Oh, I didn't pop. Oh, no. <laughs> no, <laughs> I tried to pop it. My tool, not a toy. Kid, kids watching? Tool, not a toy, bud. <clears throat> Tim's out here sucking lactate. The lunatic's out here jamming like a goddamn cat. Oh. Ban the horses out here talking about horses. Oh, wait, what's that? Feet. I thought horses were measured in hands. What's a guy to know? Mozzarella saying kachiga, kachiga, kachiga. It's like a small model airplane. I just ate an entire salami sandwich on thick cut multi grain bread with some Colby Jack cheese and yellow mustard. So I have to be making my dad noises, of course, like. <laughs> Hi, Spin Haley, how are you? Hi, ZX, how are you? Hi, Sundermain, how are you? Gus, you ever had a Kurderburger? Cur wait, Cur Kurderburger? No, I haven't. Tim says, Gus, did you read my Polar Express fan theory? I'm going to read it right now, bro. Did you get a nice slather of mayo on that? No mayo, actually. No mayo. How are you guys doing, by the way? Let's just check in. How are you? Today, today was a lot better. It was a boring, pedantic day. I had to do, I was doing fucking tax work all day, dude. But like I said on Discord over here, I decided to switch this stuff around. Uh, and I'm going to read Tim's poem just in a second, the fan theory. Um, I just switched stuff around. I have plans on Friday. I forgot with you guys, but not with the person I have plans with. Frankly, I'm going to be real. It's my anniversary on Friday, and I'm excited to celebrate it. It's going to be lovely. <clears throat> so... I've already, you know what's ironic is I made reservations at the restaurant like weeks ago too, but I forgot to tell you guys, I was like, oops, that's this Friday, so, and it's an annual anniversary, so it's a big boy one, it's a big boy one, thank you for the happy anniversary, early wishes and stuff, um, this one's going well, I'm happy about it, uh, it's a lot of fun, and I love her, spoiler alert, I, I love her, oops, oops, dare I say to speak my truth, that fucking is cool as shit. Um, I feel a lot better today. I was just, I mean, bro, I'm doing fucking tax deduction stuff. I filed an extension for this year, so I got until the 15th to get all my stuff in. It's a pain in the ass. It's a pain in the ass. What's, what else is new? So, um, that's what I did today. Feeling a lot better, though. Um, like I said, is we've already started to hammer out some new solutions for the game stuff over here, and we're cooking. Um, that's basically it. Ultrasaurus, how are you, dude? Good to see you. Thanks for seven months. Ultra goes, oops. That's Ultra on the keyboard right now. Oops. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Thank you, by the way. I appreciate it. I hope you're doing well today, Ultrasaurus. Thanks for swinging through. I saw you playing some freaking Zomboid the other day, dog. Espresso Rat. Hey there, guy. Looking good. Oh, you back at you there, guy. Good to see you, Espresso Rat. Thank you so much for 100 biddies there, Espresso. Thanks for the first Prime Sub of the day, too, by the way, a Corrupted Ocelot. I see you in here. Ocelots really do get around, brother. Oh, oops, sorry for the burp. I'm working on myself. Um, corrupted Ocelot, 14 months, one-year streak. Oh, yeah, 12 in a row. Can we go for two? They put down the dino dance, so I just, I had to do it, guy. Thank you, Ocelot. Cheers to you, guy. You love to see it. Jason Webb, by the way. Hey, Gus, I recently finished rewatching your entire Red Dead Redemption 2 playthrough on the VOD channel. No way. Thank you for doing that, dude. Oh, for, I mean, you have a huge message. I'm not going to, like, slight the other half of it. But just thank you. Anyone that spends time uh, watching VODs on Twitch or on the VOD channel, thank you. Shout out fucking 68K Mac Man, bro, for that. Anybody that watches those, thank you so much for doing that. Jason goes... Uh, the Red Dead 2 playthrough really helped me through a difficult time being able to shut off my critical thinking skills for a few hours each night to hang with you and Arthur and the rest of the gang. Thank you so much for all the good that you put out into the world. I hope everyone here as well. Bro, Jason, these are the kinds of messages that unironically and without exaggerating get me through the fucking day, bro. Get me through the day. I, I'm so proud of you for working through your tough time. Thanks for being here for mine. Love you, dude. I hope you're well. Thank you so much. And by the way, speak of the devil, speak of the Red Dead Dead Devil, announced today Red Dead 1 is coming to PC October 29th. So, end of October, I will tell you fuckers right now, we are starting Red Dead Redemption 1. That will be the next big, big single-player game. I think for the rest of October, we're going to pepper it out with finishing Fallout 3, doing more itch games, um, 
playing TCG Simulator. In fact, tomorrow's probably the day that I'll try to shart, uh, shart! Um, I don't do the- Ah, gotta, fuck! End of October is probably going to be the time when we shart. Ah! <laughs> okay, that will be the last very, very loud, very bad microphone bit that I do today. But to be fair, I honestly tried to click to the screen with just a second of clip, but I just missed the button. So I will be very well behaved from now on. And I would like to extend my sincerest apologies to you for being a little bit of a loud ass rascal. Fue un accidente. Lo siento. No es un problema porque estoy muy triste. Solamente yo dijo, lo siento. Lo siento, lo siento todavía. Lo siento. Put those away. Gus, I will pay you good money to get a limiter on that mic. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I gotta I gotta just fucking do it. I gotta just do it. I gotta do it. I'm not prioritizing it every time I come to stream. I go, oh, I'm doing this now. I'm doing this now. Hopefully we can kill some of the clippages on this too. I will try to be very well behaved. Uh hello gushers. I'm getting gas. You eating some beans, brother? Good to see you, Reno. Uh Moo too. You love it as much as the rest of you. I'll bring you a hardware limiter from the studio so you can't make excuses. Fair. Deal. Excuse me. I'm sorry for scaring your dog. I will not do- Oh, Truffles? This one goes out to your dog. Truffles dog- Put your dog on the mic. Go ahead, pop those earbuds in them. Good boy. Or girl. I don't know. I'm gonna say boy for the purpose. Good boy. How are you doing? I'm sorry, bud. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? It's me, bitch. Put Truffles back on the mic. <laughs> I, I'm really not. I'm not gonna lie again. I'm not gonna lie again. I won't be loud. I won't be loud. Um, thank you for starting this uh, stream of the hype train. Much love, fuckers, dude. <laughs> you missed the dramatic. It's the cansado opportunity. It's off the table. It is mopeds. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Your limiter is just Susan with an on-off switch, and she's doing a poor job, isn't she, Susan? It's okay. A little mic discipline would do a guy good. Obby the Rat, 15 months. I just sharted. Thanks, Gus. That's the power of suggestion for you. Sounds like it's the power of suggestion for you there, guy. Obby. <sighs> good to see you, brother. A little liquid IV down there. You'd love to see it. Thanks, Obby the Rat. Thanks, guys, for that hype train, by the way. We're going to have a fucking awesome stream tonight. I'm going to be real with you. Basilary's out here 11 months, by the way. Thank you, Basilary. You seem like a cooking ingredient every time I read your name. And it reminds me to get basil and celery. And celery salt. I got plenty of that. Busy Bees out here subbing up Rogue Knight 518. Thank you, Busy Bees. I appreciate you, my dude. Hope you're doing well, Busy. It's been lovely to see you. I've seen the shit out of you in the last couple weeks, especially. But I know you've been here for a while. <clears throat> Sorry about my ears and your ears. Boy Goose is here? Oh my god. Crazy, ultra rare, uh, alternate art. Boy Goose just appeared? Oh my god. Hope you've been doing okay, Boy Goose. Appreciate you. Basilar goes, you're welcome. Here's the thing I like the most about Pokemon streams. They're fun. Here's the thing I like the second most about Pokemon streams. I can read almost every single fucking message in chat. I love it. Last night was so fun to end the rest of the evening playing Samorost 2. Beautiful game. Not the most popular game. Shit-ass viewership. I ain't bitching, but I'm just like, you know what I mean? I totally get it. It was four and a half hours in. We're playing Space Click games from 2005. I had a lot of fun. Thanks to all the fucking folks that stuck around for that. That was cool as shit. Some other, like, goofy Leaf Green Knight, we're gonna have to play Samurai's 3, but I think I'm gonna let a couple of weeks go by. That was really, really fun, though, dude. Um, is this a real Pokemon stream or the TCG Sim stream? This is a real one. We have real cards this time. 
I got some cool deals I actually want to tell you about. I'm kind of excited. Um, I'll tell you in a, in a little bit over here what we'll be opening. Oh, Joey Ravioli. Gus, I'm getting hit directly by the hurricane. Can you draw a hollow Blastoise uh, to blow it away from me, please? I got you, Joey. Also, folks, how are we doing? Hurricane Milton about to fuck shit up, dude. You guys get the fuck out of Florida yet? What do you? What, how's it going down there? Real cards are better than TCG Sim Ultra. You're damn right about that. Have you played TCG Sim yet? Do you think you're going to boot that one up on stream there, Ultra? What's cooking in the oven for dinner tonight, brother? Good question, Dizchem. Nothing too crazy tonight. I'm torn. Long day, a lot of work. Um, you guys know I've been cooking like a motherfucker. I did not utilize the crock pot today. The chili that I made on Sunday... Knock me over with a feather, brother. It was goddamn fucking awesome. I thought it was going to be a lot spicier, though, but I used half the cayenne because I added a fresh jalapeno. And unfortunately, that did not disperse through the sauce as much, but it was a delicious blend of chili. So um, I had one serving of that left. I gave it to my girlfriend for the evening to take home. So she's probably munching on it as we speak. I'm probably just going to put some lemon herb chicken breast in the oven. You know, tenderize those motherfuckers. Excuse me. I just got two giant, big old Babs ass chicken breasts. They're pre marinated with lemon and a little bit of, yeah, it's probably basil, oregano, and shit. Just like lemon Italian herb kind of shit. I'm just going to bake those in the oven. Probably just make up some rice and uh, do either butter corn or green beans tonight. Just nothing too crazy. <coughs> but uh, tomorrow's going to be a big day. Big shoot day. We got Sean's coming over, Ryan, and, or not Ryan. Ryan's uh, busy with family stuff. Sean's coming over. Matt's coming over. Ben's coming over. I got to hit up Lisa, see if she's down to shoot. I, I totally forgot to text Lisa. I was supposed to. I'll get I'll get her in a sec here, though. Um, yeah, so that's what's going on tomorrow. Thursday, like I said, another working day. Probably play little games at night. I don't know. Friday's my anniversary. Tonight, though, we are here to fuck around. I'm going to try to be live, honestly, for at least three, four hours tonight. I think it's going to be a nice long hauler. I appreciate it. You guys, already the folks in here, better numbers even to start here on a Tuesday night. These card streams are fun as shit. We got fake Pokemon packs we'll do fake rare bets with. And we have some Desert Storm packs that we're going to have to open. Get that Dick Cheney. Get that Get that Saddam Hussein. Hussein, we're not pulling Hussein. All right? Put him on the line because you know I'm saying we're pulling Saddam, dude. Ultrasaurus says, I have played TCG Card Simulator and with or TCG Shop Simulator. I don't know it. And with the Pokemon mod, it's 100% worth trying. Okay, I love to hear that. So ZX from the community here gave me the instructions on how to install that Pokemon mod, which I absolutely will be doing. And we're going to probably fire that up tomorrow. That'll be awesome. <clears throat> Excuse me. TCG Sim is fun, but not really a stream game. I IMO. I'm sure th that's what I probably assumed is it seems like a passive kind of trickle thing. So I envision it without even playing it yet of like, I'll probably do maybe a couple streams worth and then we'll see what the legs are like on that and then just kind of play accordingly. Kind of like Hitman. I mean, Hitman was fucking awesome. Folks started dropping off quick on it. So I was like, that was sick. Awesome first time playthrough. Probably not a 30 hour game for stream. So Yahoo, Anthony Silvestri. Good to see you, brother. Oh, dude, Monster? I'm not even fucking with you, bro. I told you I was going to put photos in the uh, in the Discord. I forgot to do it. Let me immediately become a man of my word and at least show you my phone screen, dude. I have been using those, those pot holders like goddamn crazy. Thank you so much. Uh, I have a few photos over here that I took of them. <clears throat> kind of dying. That's okay. Getting over it. Oh, man, what the hell? Okay, wait. They're right here. Monster. Don't you go running on me. Okay, so here's me using the uh, the pot holders here, Mosturk. That's me. Uh, oh, that's... Um, hold on. Okay, that's something else. This is me using the pot holders. Uh, I th ah, shit. Hold on. Okay, right here I was going to specifically show the uh, pot holders. At ah, fucking, fucking hell. Hold on. Okay. Oh, here they are. <laughs> Look, I made a beautiful Korean barbecue spread. I've used them uh, for making soups and stuff, too. Look how well my pot fits on the pot holders. Thank you, dude. Beautiful. <laughs> you got hoppered? Oh, no. Bro got hoppered, dude. 
Uh, yo, by the way, uh, I want to... Did I get everybody? <clears throat> I think I'm all caught up. Joey... Ra hey, Joey Ravioli, five bucks, brother. Thank you. Holy shit. Joey Ravioli... Uh, dude, what is going on with all these fucking nice-ass comments tonight? Joey goes, I have watched you for years, and I will continue to watch as long as you continue to upload. Your content's made me happy during hard times. Please keep it up. That means the world to me, dude. Thank you for uh, putting the wind in my sails on that guy. Here's what we're doing this week, too, by the way, Joey. Not only some new memes and sketches, like little quickie ones, but I'm going to do another main channel video. I'm really excited for it. I think I'm going to shoot it tomorrow, probably. Um, <clears throat> and then just some fun streams. So thank you, brother, for the $5. That's really sweet of you, dude. I hope you have a chill night. We're going to have a good one. This is probably going to be my favorite stream of the week, frankly. Cheers to you, Joey. I appreciate you. Discam goes, finger snaps for Joey. Let's go, baby. <laughs> that means you need uh, you need a couple more, Monster, brother. Damn, bro, you were quick, Monster. Uh, you're freaking talented. Sorry for that. That's okay. Hot Milk goes, oh, it can absolutely be a stream game. TCG Shop Simulator. I've been watching my girlfriend play it for hours at a time. It's really fun to watch. Super not my style of game, but I really find it enjoyable to watch. That's kind of cool. I'll fuck with that, dude. Coffee Black, how are you, dude? The family is still recovering from Helene. Had a cousin's house completely destroyed. Ugh, I'm sorry. Hopefully Milton is not as serious as it's looking. I'm scared. I want to be a positive person. Did you see that interview today? From the mayor of Tampa? Who saw that, first of all? Did you see the, the interview on CNN? It was the mayor of Tampa was speaking. I don't remember who the host was. Gus, did you remember to put on pants before stream? I... Uh, yes. Yes, I did. <sighs> I saw the... Wait, the clip of the weatherman crying? I did not see that one, dude. Oh, I'm going to have to add that. I have to check. What the fuck happened with that one? I won't go... I swear, hand to God, not watching the news today. All I'm saying. Also, by the way, Toledo. Thank you for 11 months. Thanks for being you, Gus. It's the meest me I'm trying to be. Thanks, Toledo. Every time I see you, I go, holy Toledo. That's what my dad says. Hell freaking yeah. Thanks, Toledo. Also, Dilbert Pickle. I see you out here 28 months, brother. Good to see you. Today isn't my birthday. But can you pretend it is? Oh my gosh, happy birthday, Dilbert Pickle. Wow, dude. You're the real Dill, dude. Oh, oh my god, sorry. Big burps. Happy freaking birthday there, Pickle. That's just awesome. I'm burping a lot. What else is new? Happy birthday, Gus and Dilbert. There we go. The old two for one. Uh, no, I mean, not to, <laughs> sorry to be ditting between, like, uh, uh, birthday talk and then serious shit, but no, the mayor of Tampa went on CNN today, Dizchem, you're right, and she said unequivocally, she goes like, I'm not going to mince words. If you're in the evacuation zones in Tampa, like, the ones that are, like, there, there's different priorities, so I don't know if it's the entire city of Tampa, I don't want to spread misinformation, but it's, all of Florida is going to get pretty fucked regardless. But she goes, if you're in these highest priority evacuation zones, if you stay there, you're going to die. You will die. I've, my whole life, I've never seen anything like this. Tampa residents, never seen anything like this. If you stay there, you are going to die. Which, I appreciate a leader saying that, because somebody like that, that's been doing this as long as she does, understands that not min mincing words can lead to, lead to saving human lives, you know? I, I hope those evacuation zone folks are safe. Um, stay safe over there, folks. It's fucking scary. Yeah, Tim, you're right. Two hurricanes in one week is goddamn wild. I saw a NASA, I don't remember if it was the ISS or somebody, but it was like NASA footage of them passing over Hurricane Milton. Um, it looks nuts, dude. It looks goddamn nuts. Yeah, there are different maps and zones and stuff. I mean, the mayor of Tampa was saying there are parts of Tampa that are allegedly supposed to get 12-foot wave swells. Like, please be safe if you are down there, legitimately. I don't know anybody in Tampa or in Florida, really. Um, but Christ alive, please be safe. They were saying winds over 220 miles an hour. I'm not surprised, bro. That sounds fucking terrifying. 
Yeah, check in, check in on your folks. Tim saying I'm texting my cousin Orlando. Good plays. Mackie, hey, what up, bro? Good to see you, dude. And yeah, the ISS footage looks nuts. So banana sandwiches, which is a great breakfast, but not a great weather forecast, frankly. Coffee Black, because I've seen the storm surge is expected to be 15 feet. I can't imagine experiencing that. Christ. Oof, oof, oof. Yeah, anybody, I mean, who's down there right now? Please check in. What do you got? Not an undercover cop. Thanks for 145 biddies, dude. Uncle, not an undercover cop, is directly in the path. He's south of Tampa. I hope the precinct still stands. Excuse me. I, I hope that he's safe, too. Sorry for fucking with my camera during this portion. Did we get her here? I think we're good. Um, please be safe out there, guys. What the fuck? Is anybody, like, in Florida right now? You don't have to, like, oust yourself. Thanks for the bits, too. Please be safe, uh, cop. And fam. Mackie goes, I rode the bullet train two weeks ago, and it went 200 miles an hour. Winds faster than that is horrifying. That's just nuts, oh, dude. Major Patriot, lovely to see you this evening. Gus, I'm in Sarasota. It's in the direct track of the eye. The storm is going to catch major wind shear, so it'll weaken to a high Category 3, which isn't bad. It's oops, scrolled up. It's the storm surge that will be the worst ever. <clears throat> That's rough. That is rough. Please stay safe, Major Patriot. Yeah, Jason Webb. Like I, I, in fact, I should probably stop yapping with about specifics about zones of Florida, just because I don't want to like instill fear in anybody. But all I can just say unequivocally is like, please be tracking the storm, looking at see what what areas are mandatory. I mean, nothing's mandatory, but are like highly suggested evacuation zones, and like act accordingly. Because from what I've seen today, it's not necessarily too late to get out of certain parts here, and just please be tracking that because it's going to change. Um, I think that last one was from Donkey Kong Country. Yes, that's correct there, by the way. Good question, beep boop bop. Beep boop bop. Yeah, Donkey Kong Country underwater theme, that's what it was. The sustained winds are faster than free falling from an airplane. The gusts are faster than standing behind a jet. Eesh, da Christ. Oi, oi, oi. <laughs> <laughs> Natarox, oh, dude, I got the video of you talking to your uncles, to your nieces and nephews. Yeah, I reposted the uncle video today. What up, dude? Um, it's not doing very well. I'm bummed. You never know what the repurpose ones because some of my biggest videos in the last three months have been just me throwing up an old sketch. So I'm definitely going to keep doing that. I'm trying to only do one a week. Um, <clears throat> this one didn't do the best, but that's okay. Ski scoot, let's freaking go, brother. I'm glad you're here for it. Da, 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 da. I'm going to put a photo on uh, Instagram here. Tell folks what we're doing there, guy. Got the nice piss, piss boy shirt on. Da, da. Guys, get in the photo. Nice smile. Da, 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 da. What is this song from? I don't know this one. And done, baby, done. Fuck yeah, brother. So couple fun things tonight. Let's talk about, first of all, what we're going to open. I'm so happy to see so many people in here. Thank you, thank you. When's the short of you throwing rocks in your underwear? I don't know if people... I don't know, like, because that one was just, like, such a direct parody of uh, primitive technology that was just popping off, and, like, every primitive technology video at the time was, like, top of our videos. So I was like, I, this is so getting posted on Reddit. I don't. I think people would still probably get it, but we'll see. I there is one uh, primitive technology video that I do want to make, and I've said it before on this channel. It'd be the easiest short in the world, but I want to do primitive technology. But he forgets the lens cap on. I don't think I need to explain how the video goes now that I said the title. Uh, but I will anyways. It's just gonna be like 15 seconds of pitch black and hearing like. <laughs> And then you hear, oh, 
What? Oh, no. Oh. What? Oh, no. What? And then I go and I take it off. And then you see like a fully built hut behind me. And I go, oh. I suppose I could still do. <laughs> no, it's done. It's done. God. <laughs> so that's, that's the video. That's, that's the whole one. Why did Mackie say Gus dot dot dot? Damn, it's like I just watched the sketch. You pretty much did. It's like I'm there right now. Well, then you take the lens cap off. Somebody's got to do it. Here's what we're opening tonight. Um, no Evolving Skies packs. I'll be real. But I'm also going to be excitedly real. We got a lot of 151 packs to open. I got them at Costco, brother. I'm buying them for like a third of the fucking price that they're going for pretty much right now. When you get them at Costco, I got some of those. I got some errant scar vies, but the big money tickers over here. I didn't get the Champions Path ETB in yet, unfortunately. That's okay. You guys see these tins around? $19.99? That's what I paid for them. You should get them if it's that price. Rotom V, these fully plastic wrapped ones. I believe the year on the back is 2022. Yes, it is. Clown Baby, hello. Right off the presses. Because though there are not Evolving Skies packs in here, there's some bangers. 20 bucks. Here's what you get in here. Two Lost Origin packs. A Fusion Strike. Two chilling rains. That's fucking great. These are all in the top five best Sword and Shield era packs. Easy. I'd say the number one Sword and Shield era pack, 100% is Evolving Skies. Number two is probably Chilling Rain, or is probably rather Fusion Strike. And then I'm I'm certain it's either Lost Origin or Chilling Rain after that. That's fucking awesome for $19.99. We got a few of those tins this evening. We're gonna be opening a lot of Fusion Strike, a lot of Lost Origin, a lot of Chilling Rain, some Silver Tempest. I got a baseball pack of cards they gave me for free. They gave me some free Brilliant Stars packs. And most importantly, 151, which is awesome. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> Wiggle Dance B gift six month subscription courtesy of Timothy has entered month six. B goes, I am a fake fan. Uh oh. It's okay. Tim goes, uh oh. Uh, nothing. <laughs> Tim, I need you to be my resident Jimmy Carter voice actor over here. Brother, my voice needs a break. I was screaming. It was rough on me. Also, these Gallade tins contain the exact same packs, by the way, as the Rotom ones. Uh, in case you're looking. Let me take the packs out of here first. Yep, same spread. Just going to get a couple of them uh, lined up here hella quick. Gallade tins, too. These are both 2022. Always look for the full plastic wrap. Here's what these look like. Boink. Oh, I gotta read the fucking... So Tim had a fan theory for the Polar Express that I am apparently in need of reading right now. Gosh, you don't need us need to lie for us to like you, buddy. My mom says that all the time. I like that. I like it. I mean my Polar Express uh, fan theory. So here's Tim's Polar Express fan theory. You guys know the... Tom Hanks movie, Robert Zemeckis directing. Bet you didn't know that. Forrest Gump, Back to the Future. Um, here's Tim's fan theory about that. Now, this is fresh off the Tim line, too. This isn't some copy pasta shit. Dimitri, what's going on, bro? Guys, can you open a big pack of Big League Chew? Oh, man, I wanted to do a bit, but I fucking love Big League Chew, bro. That shit is so tasty, dude. <laughs> it's fucking great. Good to see Demetra open a Pokemon cards tonight. Thanks for 26 months, by the way. I appreciate all the Prime subs, dog. That's illegal. Next time I see you in real life, I'm pushing you down two flights of stairs. No negotiations. Also, Lisa, howdy. How are you? 30 months, brother. Good to see you, Lisa. Hope you're doing good there, guy. Well, come on in, dog. Okay, so this is Tim's freaking off the presses uh, theory, Lisa. You want to take a peek at this? Polar Express. Tim says, observations. Tom Hanks' voice... Or, sorry, Tom Hanks, he voices the narrator of the film. The main character is all grown up. The conductor is also voiced by Tom Hanks, as is the dad, the hobo, and Santa Claus. 
the young boy ripped a hole in his jacket at the end of the movie after the plot point of him losing the bell from a hole in his pocket. After that plot point. Dad does not hear the bell, but the narrator does. Uncertain about the hobo. Here's the theory. All the Tom Hanks characters in the Polar Express are the same character. Santa's sleigh is a time machine. The boy grows up to become Santa and then travels back in time to give the bell to his young self, creating a time loop. But while he was orchestrating that, he realized that his young self needed a hole in his pocket to lose the bell in order for the events to take place. So he ripped the hole in his young self's pocket, but that made a time paradox because he didn't rip his pocket until after the events of the movie. This fractured the fabric of space-time to create three different timelines. In one timeline, he gets the bell, becomes the narrator, conducts the Polar Express for a while, which gave him the opportunity to rip his young self's pocket, and later becomes Santa. Likely, he kills the old Santa like in the Tim Allen movie because uh, although this time it's on purpose because he knows what he has to do and the cycle repeats. Okay? Also, Gavin Red Hoodie Kid. Fuck yeah, good to see you, brother. In one timeline, he never finds the bell and, consumed with guilt, tracks down the know-it-all kid and they invent time travel together. He travels back in time to find the lost bell, but he meets the mom and falls in love. They marry and have a son the main character boy. Eventually, the dad loses his belief because life got in the way. And in a third timeline, he also never finds the bell, but he gets picked up by the Polar Express the next year and just never leaves, thereby, thereby becoming the hobo. <laughs> That's a pretty good theory. I do really like that theory, Tim. That's a fucking good one, dog. So, what you decide. Do you guys believe Tim? Is he fucking lying to you guys? Guys, is Tim lying to you again? Tim! Hand over your modem and the router. Good. I like that theory. Seems pretty airtight. Mr. Poor Boy says, how does that explain the hot chocolate scene now? Ooh! That's a good question. One which I do not possess the answer. We got our packs opened up. Let's start cooking here, brother. Oh, I'm just gonna get this 151 out quick. Mackie bed. So today I came across the worst piece of information I've ever heard. Apparently kinks are hereditary. Explains why my dad lets my mom buy so many shoes. Guy, seek bed. Seek it. And commit to it. In that order, for, for the record, if Delta's sending you to bed, you gotta get the fuck to bed, bro. You know what's funny is I can't remember. I was like, who is the most bed-deserving person in chat? It's probably Takoji because of all the bab shit. Guys, I'm cooking. Brother's not. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Takoji send somebody else to bed. That is an individual that's like, I get it. I know where I'm at. <laughs> My dad raised chickens. Stop! I, I don't even want to comment on that fucking hell. My dad raised chickens. Yeah, and I got one of them sitting right here. Son of a... I can't even do this tonight. Go to Bed Bath & Beyond, brother. I agree with that statement. I really agree with that statement. That's really funny, honestly. All right, we got a bunch of heaters here tonight. Get out of here. You're so stupid. All right, do we have everything? Uh, let's go. House flights full, Susan. Thank you. Back to back to 10%. I'm going to get some ETB sleeves from the closet here, and then let's fucking cook, dude. We're gonna have a banger night tonight, dude. Also, I didn't even realize I have five packs of Crown Zeniths too, dude. My dad raised a shrimp named Gus. What does that mean? Um, I think it means Sleepy Garrett. Ten months. Let's go, baby. Sleepy. Always so fucking positive. I appreciate you, Garrett. Thanks for joining us. Oh. 
I'm gonna get these sleeves. I'll be right back, okay? Alright, let's cook. Let's fucking cook. Holy fucking shit, let's cook. Oh my good gracious me. There we go. Alright, Pokey Cam. Activate. Beep. There we go. Oh, excuse me. How's Jimmy Carter doing since he took away the Legos? I'm going to be real. He's taking it pretty freaking rough, dude. He's not, It's not sitting well with him. He's just been kind of crying and kicking stuff off and on, which is, if anything, probably good physical therapy for him at this age. But um, from a from a attention span and attitude standpoint, it's no good. Bro's down bad, dude. He's going to have to go around the horn. If he turns 104, then I will reconsider his uh, application. So... We will see. God, can you imagine if that guy even lives one more year? I, what does his day-to-day -day look like? Here's the promo card on that Crown Zenith 10, by the way. Let's get you a little focus. Whoop. God knows you guys ain't got focus. Galarian Moltres. Love to see a baby. Last time we did a poking, uh, Pokemon opening stream, it was fucking next level insane. We pulled the Charmander from 151 and the Venusaur from 151 out of the same box and a Ninetales and, like, a Grusha and, uh, like, some big Erica's Invitation or some shit. I don't remember. He lives in a hot springs for his health. I mean, that sounds like a good play. I probably live there too, dude. Let's start with Silver Tempest. Yay, guys. We're opening Brokemon cards. Nice. Nice. First pack magic. Can I have a Lugia, please. Yeah, we got the top of Tio in the back for the good luck. I don't know if I've seen Ted yet, though. I'm kind of scared. I'm going to need some anomalous luck this evening. Maybe I missed him. Could be user error, but the verdict is still out. Meetang. Toxapex. Uh, what cards are we hoping for? Well, we're really hoping for a giant Lugia out of here. I'd say overall tonight, I'd love that Alt Art Giratina. The Alt Art Gengar would be awesome. Look at these freaking... These are just a bunch of neighborhood mutts in this pack. No first pack magic. Honestly, we're opening probably eight or nine different sets of cards tonight. Good ones? I could, Dude, I could see myself going for several good ones. That'd be the hope. Man, Lost Origin. It's fun to be able to open a lot of Lost Origin, too. I don't know if I have any Astral Radiance, but I am still going for that Machamp out of there. Be kind of nice. Lost Origin's fun because it's got some big heaters to chase, and then also this has a Trainer Gallery and a Galarian Gallery in there, so you can still get some good cards, even if your code card is white. We shall see. Fantina. Obama. Sidat. Sologma. Dynamo. Frickin' Lit Leo over here. Got Nancy Kerrigan over here. Mindfu. This is cut weird. Nothing valuable. Comfy. And on the end, Manectric. Takoji redeemed loves... Redeemed Takoji loves Babs. Yo, hold on. <laughs> That's the new channel point reward? What? Wait, how do I... How am I supposed to reward that? That was all his... <laughs> You took bro out of the running for a fucking signed card. <laughs> That's so funny. No hesitation. I mean, I feel like I'd be an asshole unless I gave you just some full on. I mean, 
I gotta show like all the Babs, right? I already have a side card. <laughs> this is like, you know, on Survivor when they do those auction rounds where they're like, here's $500 and then they auction off to buy peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and shit. Oh my God. I mean, all right, bro, hit the redeem. Here, incoming Babs, guys. I hope you're sitting down. Get a nice textbook, cover yourself up. You know what I mean? Here we go. Start from the back as per usual. And beautiful, you do in fact love to see it. Okay, Babs is going up in value with how much screen time we're giving her. All right, we're back and locked in. Holy balling off this, that's what I'm saying, brother. Bada bing, bada boom. For those who missed it, the description was, Takoji won't spend all his points on this because he's scared. <laughs> Tim, bro. Tim, you did him dirty, dude. That's so funny. Well, guys, that's probably the leading meme of the evening. Don't see that one getting topped, frankly. Unless we pull a Giratina. And then he freaking did. I mean, nobody's accused uh, Takoji of being anything other than brave and persistent. So, there you go. That's pretty funny. The whole time I thought Babs was the rabbit from Space Jam, not the chicken from Chicken Run. Oh, brother, how mistaken you have been, Magbot. Boom. Gavin, you think so, dude? Get a win on this one? Gavin, bro! Let's go! How did you know that? There's not two in here. I knew it. Dude, Radiant Steelix. All right, first hit of the day. How pretty is that one, too? I like that. Takoji deserves VIP after that maneuver. Okay. Bump, bump, bump. I think I can do this here. Ba, 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 ba. How do I here? Oh, I can do this. <laughs> Did I do it? Say something. Say something, coward. Wago Dance B deserves VIP because she's the best fiance in this Twitch chat. And then B says, <laughs> B go, wait, where the fuck are you? Tim, that is just cringe. Guys, guys. Figure it out. Takoshi goes, I don't know how I should feel. <laughs> it did work. That's fucking hilarious, bro. That's really funny. I So this is the first form of hesitation that you feel, Takoji. Bro had the foot on the gas pedal the whole time, and the second that we went, okay, validated, he went, um, I didn't ever think you'd do anything about that. <laughs> oh. Okay. Reno goes, Takoji got himself to the top through pure lust. Beautiful. I don't feel like there's any sort of lessons anybody should be learning from this one, frankly. Slim Cognito redeemed for 49 biddies. Takoji won't. That's very funny. This is one of the free packs given to me. I did not pay $5 for this. My friend gave it to me. So I always like picking from the bonus packs because it's sort of like, ooh, what was a hit that we got absolutely out of nowhere that was not even destined to be? We will have to see. Relatable, honestly, I agree. I certainly agree. Bro, Dingo, what are Radiant cards? Certain sets have different, what are called subsets, where they have little gimmicks that are unique to that exact set of cards. And a couple sets, probably two of them, have these things called Radiant cards. I'm sure they have slightly different gameplay parameters, but they have beautiful different art. And there's only a couple cards in each of the subsets. Ryalu, Starly, Spiritomb, Exeggutor, Golurk, nothing in the bonus pack. Shit. Today I learned that if you are horny enough, you can get to the top of society. <laughs> Guys, I just won society, fortunately. Celebrations to follow. Bada big, bada boom. Okay, 151 time, brother. First of the day. 
Y'all ready? Let's see what we get. Another Florida boy who we hope is staying safe. IDK of Pensacola is in the path, though. I hope it isn't. Gus pull a Mew? Okay, I will. How many swirls on here? I see one, I see two. Perhaps just two, frankly. Basic energy, far-fetched. Shelter. Helix fossil, slow poke. Come on, baby, show me the Mew. Ben Tanda with the biddies. Let's go, brother. I'm shocked you're awarding such behavior. If I knew being so verbal about my lust for Babs would be rewarded, I would not have felt shame. <laughs> Bro had to lean into it to make it to the other side, though, dude. It was not that easy. It was it was some hard work for years with no reward. Thank you, Ben Tendo. Haunter, that's cool as shit. Slow bro, and ooh, that's cool. Daisy's help. 151, what the fuck is this? No idea what that's worth. That's one of those cards that could be worth $1 or 50 bucks. No idea what that shit's worth. Daisy's help? It's a cool card. I don't even know the trainer, Daisy. I probably had to. 538, wow, Balloonatic. Thanks for looking it up too, by the way, dude. Also, I have one pack of baseball cards that was given to me for free, too, amongst a couple other freebies here. What is she helping with? By the looks of it, landscaping? She's in a garden. Hi, I'm here to edge your sidewalk and nothing else. Kid show. Daisy's help. You gotta have it, dude. Gus, sorry if you've been hollering my name for the last few minutes. I got sucked into watching YouTube shorts, shooting them straight into my eyeball veins. Good, brother. Good. Somebody understands it, finally. Thank you. So about a $6 card. That's cool. First hit of the day, and it's a uh, hard caser, so that's always fun. Not a bad card. Really beautiful presentation on the trainer, too. Uh. Excuse me. Well, the single last card to get out of this entire set for me... Chilling Rain is the Blaziken Alt Art. I have every other single card possible from Chilling Rain. In fact, if I really think about it, I think I've only ever 100%ed two sets before. I know I've 100%ed, and in terms of organic pulls, not pro, not like purchases, I've 100%ed Vivid Voltage, no question. I've 100%ed um, Shining Fates as well. And you know what? I might have 100% of Champion's Path, actually, now that I got that Charizard V off stream weeks ago that I already paid for. God, you guys are screaming. Guess the energy, by the way, is going to be for the next Fusion Strike pack. Fusion Strike. Sphinx Child goes, I hate that you stared at me like that after saying nothing else. And I was staring specifically at you, too. Gavin, it's so good to have you in here for the first time, bro. Being hype as hell. Thanks for coming over from Instagram. I thought we usually do these on Fridays. I... I just, I'm kind of restructuring for the week, dude. We're doing it on a, uh, a little Tuesday over here, guy. No, okay, I like this. I could sure use Daisy's help. We're pretty understaffed at work, okay? Uh, tap her in. Let's go. Sub in. Sub in. I like this song that's playing right now. Bada bing, bada boom. Aki goes, I just came out as bi to the girl I'm dating, and she also came out as bi and sent me the Spider-Man meme. Dude. Mackie, that's fucking sick as hell, bro. That's a great response, too. Open-minded, chill, funny meme. Papa John's, brother. Let's go, dude. Right up here, dog. Right up here. Real quick. <coughs> that was probably louder on the mic than uh, deserved to be. CX goes, love that for you, Mackie. Fuck yeah, dude. Mackie's an OG over here if you're just swinging through. That's awesome, bro. It's been nice to hear some of the fun updates like that, dude. Life is good in the neighborhood. There you go, baby. This next card is pro is what Mackie looks like right now. That seems a little more distressed than I was hoping. Ne next card is what Mackie looks like right now. That's what Takoji should be doing most of the time. Next card is what Mackie looks like right now. Whoa, yup! <laughs> okay, I think bro will take that. Uh, yeah. Here we go. That's also a cool card. I like this one. Electivire. 
Gumshoe? You're glad it didn't get the gumshoes, brother. That would have been too much. Man, that's a sick car. We got Mag Mortar over here. Fuck yeah. It's a pretty one. I think that's a dollar or two. Nothing crazy. Yeah, there's some great art. Great art. Uh. That is, gum shoes is you? You can have gum shoes. The Mackie card is pretty dope. Mm. Electivire. Look at that beautiful sky. I like it when they just like showcase a bunch of blue sky in a Pokemon card. Why'd you send Captain Nemo to bed? Cause ja oh, dude, talking about blue balls. My God, you guys grow up. Christian chat. Christian chat. Captor, how we doing, brother? Good to see you, dude. I like when they let the art breathe. That is pretty satisfying. Gotta let that art breathe, brother. Art does not belong in a museum. It belongs in an open field in the middle of the wind and rain. I've said it for years. Nobody's been listening to me. Put me in charge of the fucking art, dude. Good. I poured the Diet Coke in so fast I thought it was going to overflow. It did not. All right, we'll keep cooking. I like the Electivire. It's nothing crazy. Like I said, it's probably about two bucks, but it's cool. It's a cool two dollars. Guys, Mackie likes sports. Let's open our one card of our baseball pack just to honor him. Oh, the camera. Got just to honor him. Okay. This was given to us for free. We got some freebie packs from our friend at the card store. Also, um, <laughs> wait, yes, baseball. It's my thing. Guys, it's my thing. Also, after this, I forgot channel point bet. It's going to go for that fusion strike pack in the back. So if you bet your channel points, you y'all about to get rich right after this MF shit. Can we go like this? Center my ass up a bit? Yes, we can. Also, this is going to bug me. I just noticed that my camera has got a little tiny sliver. No, it doesn't. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Where are my baseball fans at? I don't know fucking shit about baseball cards at all. I know a lot about baseball the game, not baseball the teams or the players or the league. My dad's a baseball coach. I pitched and played first base. Yeah, a pretty good batting average. I don't remember what it is offhand. So this is Baseball Tops Heritage High Number 2023. Packs with a special insert may contain only five to eight cards. John R. Blade, brother, good to see you. How's the Skyrim house going? It's I'm in it, dude. I'm freaking in it. Tim with 250 bits. Thank you, dude. Tim goes, Bill Nye's evil twin. Bill Nike, the sports guy. T Tim, I love you. And your jokes are great and I want to foster independent comedy. But that was a 50-bit joke. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, hit us with a 50-bit joke. Tim, are you really blowing our wedding fund on these kinds of jokes? <laughs> Dude, take his credit card away, B. Take his fucking credit card away. Eddie Bizzle, what's going on, dude? Good to see you. Blood rain? That is not the time. Do not reward this kind of behavior. This is bullshit. Absolute bullshit. Skip the grip, brother. Ten months. Let's go skip the grip. Thank you so much, dude. Skip the grip. Get right to the dinner, okay? Ah, uh, delicious. Okay, but just imagine how well Sven would play the character of Bill Nike, the sports guy. He'd kind of kill it. He'd kind of kill it. All right, I need your help on this one in case I miss anything. Uh, that, like, probably good, but I can't imagine this is a good set because I got it for free. Anthony Volp. We got Chris Pubic. Cool. We got Jeff Lindgren. We've got Brent Hedrick. Minnesota Twins. That's my sports team. Minnesota. Landscape version. Ooh, rookie card. What's this? 
Masataka Yoshida. I don't know. That's probably not anything crazy. It's not numbered. Masataka Yoshida. Nice Pokemon. He's on the Red Sox. It's not crazy, but he's cool. I could I could dig that. I will still sleeve him. No, it's not. Waylon Mock is not 9817. That's still cool though. Can you get a real baseball from these packs? Um, I don't know if you can. I don't believe so. That being said, let's see what the next card is. Oh, there's something like stuck in here, dude. Yo, maybe. <laughs> okay, maybe, though. Jackie Bradley Jr. <laughs> it's a Kevin Bass miracle. <laughs> Gus, is it signed? Not yet. JJ Bled... Bled A. Bled A. Bled A. Andrew P. Heaney. Justin Verlander. Oh my god, I know Justin Verlander. Wait, didn't this guy used to play for the Twins? Am I stupid? No, he didn't. Why do I know his name so much? Justin Verlander. I could have sworn. Yeah, I was like, this guy's been around for a while. That guy I remember hearing when I was in fucking middle school, dude. Cool, I mean, well, we got this thing. Rookie performers. I can't imagine that's worth shit. Probably not even worth looking up. I'll probably just take that back into the sports shop and be like, you guys want to have this? Can I have a free pack? Please, please, please. Uh, Masataka Yoshida. Nice card. What's the tits out for JJ shit? What am I missing? Damn, dude. Baseball cards are kind of cool. I like the retro backs like that. That's kind of sick, too. Smells good. Guys, this just in. Sports cards smell better than Pokemon. More at six. What the hell? Da, 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 da. All right. Channel point bet time, brother. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. Tits out for J Justin Verlander. We've since done it. Haley just likes saying tits out for stuff she likes, I think. <laughs> just tits out. You sitting at like Applebee's, they bring out a two for 20. Tits out. And they're like, again, please don't do this. It's dinner service hour. And uh, this is a family establishment. Haley's out there with the ketchup on the table going, tits out. And they're like, I don't want to have to bounce you from this uh, Applebee's. Please. Please. Heliolisk. Skarmory. Come on, brother. Let's get some good focus up in there. Skarmory. Jinx. Manteen, Grubbin, Rotom, Galarian Corsola, Excelgore. Man, nothing in there, and we get shafted with a freaking metal energy. That's no good. That's the least fun energy. Get that, get that freaking crap out of here, I think, actually. Dude, I'm so excited for a shoot day tomorrow. We're going to have so many friends over making sketches. That dun 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 <laughs> um, I'm gonna pull Blaziken really quick. Big metal payout, brother. You're damn right. This, we have had a couple, not like egregious miscuts, but just weird edge miscuts so far here. Yoshida card is probably worth a couple bucks. Probably Volp, probably a dollar. That's kind of fun. Ba -ba -boom. You know Justin Verlander from his porno pics with Kate Upton? Wait, what? I remember Kate Upton, the model. That was another middle school one where people were like, ooh, Kate Upton. For I'm 29 right now, so people when I was growing up were like, ooh, Kate Upton, ooh, Megan Fox. Those were the big ones that you'd hear the dumbass boys in the locker room say. But did he do a sex tape or something with her? That's his wife? We should not be speaking of other people's affairs like that. We're here to open children's cardboard. 
least fun energy? Bro's a big show for water energy? What? No, I don't like big water. I'm big leaf green, brother. Big leaf green. Okay, second 151 pack of the night. 151 is traditionally very good for us. Dun, dun. Lunatic out here leaf greening. Bro out here working, dude. Guys, I showered today and put on my piss boy shirt. What does that say about me? Ooh, actually, Ski Scoot, we're probably going to start TCG Shop Sam tomorrow with the Pokemon mod. So that'll be fun. Ekans, Cubone. Gavin says you got a big good feeling about this one, Gavin. I hope you're right. Crab Titty. Energy Sticker. Rhydon. Pinsir. Kabuto. I do like it. I, I'm still going to give it a small sleeve. Flareon, that's fucking cool, bro. I actually don't know if I pulled this card yet. Destructive Flame and Fighting Blaze. Cool. <laughs> cool. Sick. Oh, Mackie, that's not good. Oh, there's a different Mackie? Um. Okay. What? Ow. <laughs> what? Did I wake up today? Gus, picture this, friendo. Tim and me, shirtless. Re I don't know if I should read this. Tim and me, shirtless, wrestling in your backyard. We're sweating up a storm, giggling and hollering. Your commie neighbors glaring through the fence post. Tim and I are sweating like absolute madmen. You start giggling too. We go out for Taco Bell later and we all get really upset stomachs while at the mall afterwards. <laughs> Stupid. Could somebody uh, head, head over to Joe's house? Sorry, Joe's house and uh, unplug the router? That'd be big for the program. Thank you. Great story. <laughs> Mackie, six million. <laughs> Mackie goes, if somebody actually does this, I'll ban them. If anyone creates a Twitch count account in the format of Mackie number trillion, I will ban it immediately. <laughs> I'm on it, says Joe next door. What the hell is going on? What the hell? Candace. I remember when Crocker Rock was young. Me and Bae had so much fun. Chiming echoes and skipping Phoebus. Had Fennekin, Chevy, and spin a rack of my own. That one, that didn't translate as well at the end. Wrote him. Hisui and Lilligant. Shit. I'm already jonesing for it. I want another 151. In fact, with the Flareon Hollow, I'm still going to count that as a hit. Unblemished record of 151. Gus, please stop sending people to my house. I don't have enough cheese and crackers to go around. Guys, bring your own cheese and crackers if you're going to Jowses's. I don't know how many times i got to tell you this on stream. It's a BYOC and C policy. Clearly. I love 151 too. And it's getting expensive as shit, so I'm only buying them when I find them at Costco, brother. Diglett. Go check your Costco's, by the way, guys. Muck. Daisy's help. Already got your big sister. Last three. Prime Ape. Nidoran. Oh, Beedrill. That's a stinker. First strikeout on 151. That's okay. I gotta get this one in the mix. I forgot. We need some Scarvi coming through. Fiona goes, Costco gang? Dude, especially since I started cooking like a motherfucker a year and a half ago, Costco saved our ass, dog. I save hundreds of dollars every couple of months there going to Costco, getting my especially spices and shit, dude. Oh, excuse me, you guys have any idea how much freaking granulated garlic you can get for not but eight dollars? Crazy. Crazy. A little Mariadon tin. Tits out for Costco. Guys, just because Haley says tits out, we can't put our tits out for everything, okay? We need to be selective. Jeepers creepers. Selective tittage. I cannot close this one. That's okay. We'll circle back. Why is Tim breaking the fucking rule? B, take the credit card away. Take the credit card. Burn it. Actually, what my mom would do is she would shred the credit card and separate them into multiple different garbage loads so no one would steal our information. My mom likes doing stuff like that. 
asked him, thanks for 500 biddies, go to bed, you're banned. Breaking the law. Tim goes, okay, so here's a real story that I think Mackie and others would like. My old youth pastor, Chris, was an alumnus at the university that I attended. And at the university center, there are these glass cases showing memorabilia from sports and stuff. Chris showed me that in one of these cases, labeled as a game ball, used in the 1920s versus Georgia Tech, is a baseball that he himself put there? Back in the day when they were installing those showcases, he snuck that ball in and no one noticed. That's funny, dude. That is very, very sick. What a meme, dude. Oh, man, I would want to go back to the campus just to see that that's still in there. He signed it, quote, to all my fans, Chris Rogers. Bro, that's great. I I hope that stays there forever. That's so funny. Because at this point, anybody that replaces the case, who's going to look at that and be like, bullshit, Chris Rogers? Like, that's so fucking funny. That should have been the 250-bit joke. <laughs> yeah, Gavin, you're right. 500 is perfect, though. Thank you, Tim. I appreciate it. That's fucking hilarious, dude. Oh, that's a good one. That's a really good one. That's like the next level of like, I stuck my friend's picture onto the wall at McDonald's, you know? Natarock, bro, thanks for 500 biddies, bro. Guys that think Gus needs to be shown the love today just because we love him. Dude, love, nothing but love for all you fuckers. I'm good, dude. This is a good pace. We got good viewership. Thank you so much for 500 more biddies too, dude. Cheers to you both. Okay, you can have a couple sips. There you go. Mmm, what do you say? <laughs> I like it. That's delicious. Mackie goes, and Mackie 0241 goes, Gus, I'm a different Mackie, yes. I first started following you in 2020 uh, when you did the hot tub stream with Bruce and Sven. I, dude, you are not going to believe this. I'll finish this first. Every now and then I pop up in the comments and your response is the same other, every time. Another Mackie? I think it's happened four times now. It's, it's only because Mackie, and I love having you here, literally one of the most prolific chatters and biggest members of this community in, in years is Mackie 5 million. So it's like if an, if like Tim O Z popped up or some shit, I'd be like, Tim, another, <laughs> you know what I mean? Also, this is so funny. Mackie 0241. I am wearing the swim trunks that I wore on that Bruce Green stream. I swear to God, right now. So I never changed them. Frankly, I've been pissing shit. I'm not even pulling them down anymore. I should I should I shouldn't have said that. Shit. <laughs> oh god. That's funny. I love Bruce. You know what's so funny? I realized too when I was going through a uh, stream or Steam earlier is every single game that I ever want to check out on the library, like on the Steam store, there is like one guy who is like a Steam friend of mine that is always already fucking played the game. And that is Bruce Green every single time. <clears throat> Excuse me. Every goddamn time. It's so funny. It's like, one friend has played this. Bruce. I'm like, yeah, bro owns every fucking game under the goddamn sun. Are you kidding me, dude? New poll name for new Mackie. Oh, God. <laughs> you guys slug this one out. See, all my colleague has is, oh, college has is a donger hidden in the drop ceiling in the dorm. That's, that's still a good treat, though. Hey, first Scarvi pack of the night here. Paldea Evolved. I think I'm going to pull focus a little farther. I'm abusing my mod privileges. That's okay. Bro's utilizing. It's not abusing, it's utilizing, dude. How you doing, Terror? Good to see you, dude. Bada bing, bada boom. Guys, everyone change your name to be a variation of Mackie number million. He can't ban all of us. Oh, God. Guys, figure it out. Guys, let's use our words, okay? Yeah, dude, I like the honesty because it, it instills a sense of legitimacy into your vouch. Gavin goes, I'm feeling something mid for this one. I I hope it's mid just so that Gavin could be right and, and his word can be a little bit more accredited. I put a foil packet of mayonnaise above a door frame in my high school cafeteria, says Floyd to Barber. It was there all year and I got updates for several years after I graduated that I was still there. 
Had no idea I started something so enduring, but I was proud to be a part of something. I like that, Floyd. Bookmark on that one, because I got a good story. Magikarp. Grab Fave Fifi. Gavin. Your word is bond, brother. You now have gained credibility. Mackie. Oh, no, it's Natarok. Oops. My. Thank you, Natarok, for 200. Finger. <laughs> Thank you so much, Natarok, for all the biddies, bro. Hope you're having a good day. Appreciate you, dude. I do like the, the dedication to double tap the finger to get it right. Thank you so much for 300 more, bro. I so fucking appreciate it, dude. What did you say? Gavin, you, I just prayed. You, I said that you called it right. There was going to be a mid-pull in here. There's nothing in there. Slipped. Oh, my God. That's funny. Dude, thank you so much for all the biddies, bro. So appreciate that, Natarok. Happy fucking Tuesday. This is going to be the hypest stream of the week here uh, in terms of, like, being able to chat with chat and shit. Again. <laughs> Thank you for 400, dude. Getting us almost immediately to level two of the hype train. Thank you, Natarok, dude. You can have one more sip. But I didn't wipe my mouth on this one, so sorry, unfortunately. Sadiator, when's the TCG Source Simulator Pokemon mod stream? Tomorrow. Won't that be fun? That's actually not a joke. We're going to do the Pokemon mod for that. That will be tomorrow's activity after the shoot day with folks. Uh, I hope you can make it, Sadiator. Thanks for 10 months. You guys didn't just hear the fart I let out while I was talking, right? Good. Okay, good, good, good. We're all work friends here. It sounds good. Um, whoa! Espresso Rat! Tight Fiver! Holy shit! Summon up Deadly Pizza, the Whittler Osapo. Jalapeno Butt. Oh. And of course, we got freaking Bada Base 2, brother. The sequel's always better. Thank you so much, Espresso Rat. I really appreciate you doing that, dude. Oh, dude, Salmonella 2? Uh, uh, <laughs> dude, Salmonella. Summon up the, that one user guy, Sphinx Child, Kyphosian, Brand Flakes 5, the fifth sequel's always better? I don't know. And Sky was the limit. Thank you, dude. Guys, I appreciate the sub bombs. Thanks for doing that. Holy shit. Oh my god, Everest, what the fuck, dude? Yo, to mess and tenor? Oh, you're knocking the burps right out me, guy. What the fuck? Dude, we're on level six. Um. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, Epirus. Also subbing yourself up. Love you too, Epirus. Nothing but cheers at you, brother. Thank you so much, dude. God damn, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> Mackie posted Oprah's you get a car and you get a car and you get a car. Thank you so much, dude. God damn Eddie Bizzle goes I didn't even know there was a level six dude. They added them uh, this last year Neither Mackie's first nor last name is Mackie. I bet he doesn't even have five million dollars Don't say that Tim. That's not real. Please stop. Also, by the way, thank you so much uh, Sadiator again and I'm not letting this one fall by the wayside. Mackie, in a show of supreme solidarity, has subbed up Mackie. Mac, Mackity Mac, don't talk back, as they say in school. And they, they'll continue to say it, frankly, as long as I'm alive here. Mackie, thanks for the Mackie love, brother. I appreciate it. Natarok, all the biddies, dude. Thank you so much. Segfall Core Dump! Let's fucking go. Good to see you. Have you been hit with the smooth making Ralph? Oh. Well, now I have. Shit. I hope Rager's treating you well. Some good, some bad, brother, but the game itself is looking fucking sick. Thank you, sick Paul Core Dump. Zealoth, good to see you. Dude, a lot of names that I haven't seen in a little bit, too, by the way. Zealoth, thanks for 22 months. Holy shit. 45% of the way through level 6. Thank you very, very, very much. This is the fucking star music, too, by the way. This is the time to get a hit. 151, let's fuck shit up. Come on. Blood Rain with the biddies. Thank you, Blood Rain. I like it. No, it's Mackie. Oh, sorry. All right, time to get a big boy hit. It's all because of your handsome haircut, Gus. Oh, you. Oh, you. Oh, Mr. Bizzle. Oh, you. All right, here we go. One to the front. A spread. Dude, <laughs> one less than 420, which is fucking fitting because we got a fucking sparkly waxified leaf green. All right, smoke them if you got them, dude. Might be a little hot, though. It's okay. Uh, Leaf Green Energy, Espresso Rat. Let's go, dude. Salute to you. 
I'll give you a shrimp salute. Thanks, Espresso. God damn, bro. Really, really appreciate you doing that. Thank you. I got to go to bed right at the next hit. Make it count. Dude, I will get a hitter for you, Tim. No worries. You got hitters in these streets, brother. Crazy G226. Four months. Thank you, Crazy G. That was my name in Catholic school. How'd you know? Let's get some heat over here. Thank you, Crazy G. Caterpie. Salmonella with the biddies. Here comes the card with the national debt. Oh, please, God. Oh, please. Destroy this budget. Beautiful executor. Thank you, Salmonella. Rigid Band Graveler. This music does fit the hype train. Keep her cooking. Hit Mon Lee. Yes, dude. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Nine Tails EX. Beautiful. Okay, that's sick as hell. We got the other golden Nine Tails last time. We got the different one. Ooh, mama. Ooh. Gosh, you should play some TCG simulation with Pokemon add on. Uh, dude, I'm not even shitting you. You guys can verify. I said that a couple times in stream. I'm doing that tomorrow. I'm doing it tomorrow. Thank you, Tim. The 072, brother. Thank you. Ultrasaurus still chilling with us. Good to see you as well. Thanks for hanging out all night. Also, Ultra, you just chill as fuck with our community and myself. That's very, very kind of you, dude. I hope, I hope you've been having a good week so far. Let's fucking go. Do you take requests on the DVD player? I'd love to see Indian in the cupboard next. Dude, I loved that movie and book growing up. If they have a GIF version of it, then yeah. <laughs> Mackie's screaming at Mackie. We only watch Shrek. It's just Shrek. Wheel of Fortune ass track plan. This is true because we're about to get them hits. Two in a row, question mark. Also, Espresso Rat 72. Thank you, Rat. This is also honestly my place to hang and vibe. Thanks for streaming. Seriously. Dude, I appreciate you, dog. It's always fun to do some uh, old up north chatting too, by the way. We got a couple uh, a couple users in here. Folks like Slim, Noe Cozy, and people, too, that uh, uh, that really like swinging through and giving some up north updates, too, whether it's Wisconsin, Minnesota, Canada, other places. It's always It always makes a guy smile. It's a little taste of home, dog. Makes me miss the old fam ski. Crown Zenith feels right, right? Gus, I got my finalized divorce paperwork back from my lawyer today. Should I upload the full document to the Discord? No, okay. Memes aside, do not do that. <laughs> For your own sake, bro. Also, the judge who did the review final judgment was named Susan. Was that you, Susan? Did You didn't proceed over... You did not? She's saying she didn't. Well, then, what's that? I'm not paying for you to take the bar. That is an extracurricular activity that frankly needs to come out of your own goddamn pocket. I'm not... Yeah, you can use the textbooks in the teacher's lounge. We have a teacher's lounge, by the way. I don't know if... <laughs> <laughs> Lisa, thanks for 100 biddies, dude. I appreciate the hype biddies. Um, pretty much a level 7 hype train. Fuck yeah. Thank you, guys. Out of nowhere, very cool of you. Dude, we're going to get some heaters tonight. I really appreciate it. Bada bing. Bada boom. Here we got an electric. Luxio. Ugh. Big burp. ZX goes Midwest update. Nice chilly mornings. Days are still a bit warm, though. That's where it should be. That is where it should be. Emolga. Retrieval. Luxio. And on the end, a hollow Entei. I like me some Entei. Let's go, baby. I think it's time for a certified government-sponsored piss break, as they say. A little urine break. Would you give me two minutes? Thanks for the hype train. I'm going to be on for at least two more goddamned hours. Back to you, Jim.
how to love you. Natarok just subbed up God. Thanks. Love that guy. <laughs> Thanks, Natarok. Big man upstairs needs a little prime sub love too, brother. You know how it is. Thank you, Natarok, for being so hyped tonight. I hope you have a good week ahead of yourself. That was not two minutes. Sorry, it's two and a half. Decided to wipe this time. It's fucked, I know. I get it. Won't happen again, gamers. Sorry. Uh, you know what will happen again, though? Probably a big-ass hit out of Silver Tempest. I still don't know how to play the card game. Mason Gasco, brother, me too, dude. That's okay. Oh, sorry, guys. I accidentally opened a pack with nothing in it. I promise this won't happen again. Okay, if I was wrong, I would have been pretty upset with myself. I will not do that again. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Earth and Seal Stone. I'll put, I'll put one up there. Gus, a little housekeeping in the mod core. Low prio, no rush. Big rush, high prio. Uh, um, dear Gus, this is Mozzarella, Mackie, and Tim. Please delete your channel ASAP. Be oh. Uh, oh, I'm doing it. Wait, high prio. That's a good idea. I'm doing it right now. Let me squeeze the tin board out of here. Big step ah, underground mecca. I've had that dumbass song in my head all day. I did it. I did that too. <laughs> dun 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 dun. They should see it in just un segundo, frankly. Good idea, folks. Let me know if there's any other people that I probably missed. I'm a big step off. Pokemon Wrecker. Open all the hits until I get something cool. <laughs> doesn't, doesn't really work. Doesn't work. Two people did just get VIP'd. And let me tell you, overdue? Subsequently, a long time coming, brother. A long time coming. Let me flip it around. Gus deleted his channel. <laughs> Phalanx Combi. Jigglypuff. Bramblegast. Toxicroak. Crocolor. Calamitous Snowy Mountain is one of the funniest names of a Pokemon card ever. That's a Yu Gi Oh shit. Jack be nimble. Jack be quick. Jack th thanks Natarok for the click. That's how it goes, right? Natarok summoned up Lucifer. I was going to complain, but you know, it does kind of balance it out. That is the yin and the yang. So I can't gripe at all, brother. I can't do it. Thank you, Natarok, so very much, dog. I appreciate it. Oh, we got a little full art card. Slow King EX. <laughs> Spider not joking. Holy shit. God, fuck you. Don't like that at all. Susan, lights 100. Did you see? Was that on camera? Did you see that? Uh, it's on the floor. I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna let it go. What the fuck was that? Yeah, no, did not enjoy. Did not enjoy. It was he it was right here. Where the fuck did that come from? I think it came down from the ceiling. Did anybody honestly see it was tiny? It was a smaller white one. Okay. 
V is a VIP. That's what just happened. Okay, let's go frame by frame over here. I will see if you can see the spider. Guys, I need your help. Actual eyes up moment here. Too much is happening. First of all, an extinct Facebook page that I made years ago just got a message. I was like, what the fuck is going on? And it was a fake copy pasta for like a copyright infringement for a musical piece. Didn't count. And then Waggle Dance B and another person in chat just got VIP'd. And now we're going to look at this Twitch clip over here to see if you can see the spider. Hold on. Actual eyes up. Get the fuck in. I can't even see. Okay. Look at on my camera. Okay, it must have happened, must have happened. Dude, I did not see it. Okay, I gotta I gotta go do a little crystal zoom. Oh, it's right in the worst spot in God's green earth. Okay, I guess you'll have to just trust me. I'm looking, I'm looking. I can't even see it in the clip, dude. I cannot even see it in the clip. I don't know how that slipped through, but it just, it came down. It was right here. It was like right here. So it had to have come from the ceiling based on the angle of the, of the uh, microphone. Cause I've had times in the past where like, it's been stuck in the apparatus of the microphone. There's spiders in here. It's basically like a gl uh, glorified sunroom, you know, that the Skyrim room's built in. I didn't like that. I don't like spiders. I definitely don't like spiders. I'm not full freak out. I will react poorly to spiders sometimes, but I'm not like can't be in the same room with them, but I certainly don't fucking like them. Dude, I had a terrible time like several nights ago. I think it was last week. I was in bed drifting to sleep and I was looking at my cell phone on my arm like this. And as I was like this, a spider out of nowhere crawled right up on my arm, beep, 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 right by my face. And it was probably three in the morning. And I, I think I woke Sven up because I texted him. I was like, sorry if you just heard that. But this is the, without exaggeration, this is the exact noise I made. It came up and I went, I, I. <laughs> I was like, I, I, I. <laughs> because I was like, it was right in front of me. It was just such a like big step underground. <laughs> I was like, no, get the fuck out of here, dude. And you, dude, I'm not even joking. I'm not even trying to save face. Because if I'd seen that in that moment, I had the opportunity to squish him. Of course, I. It was like three in the morning. Of course, I would have squashed him. He was on me, but I, I lost him. I went, yeah, yeah, yeah. I turned on the lights. He was gone. He was just gone. So I was like, cool. Now I get to go to bed with this fucking spider somewhere, and I pissed him off. Uh. Excuse me. <sighs> Silver Tempest. Underground Memphis. Yeah, that was honestly a really Looney Tunes ass sound. Thank you again, Natarok, for all the love. <laughs> We're back in it now. A little dry tonight so far. The vibes have been through the fucking roof. Easily one of the funnest uh, Pokemon streams of this year, but poor pulls. Poor pulls. Fiona goes, I vacuumed a spider from my shag rug, and I was shocked my neighbors didn't think I was being <laughs> murdered. <laughs> That's no good. That's no good, dude. Yeah, they, they scare me, dude, sometimes. I don't like them. Dewpider. Gordivore. Gordivore. Especially when you make that noise, you just don't feel good after. You just go, All right. <laughs> you just feel like such a wiener. Jay Melto just redeemed the signed Pokemon card. Congratulations, Jay Melto. Yo, hey, group cheers for Jay Melto. Bro, ground his ass off. Winning boon bounces, winning plate flips. Signed Pokemon card. Let's fucking go, dog. Hey. Gus, why are you squeezing my board, says Tim? Wait, what'd I do? I didn't try to. Wait, an accident thing. Oh yeah, squeeze my board. God, dude, the mod chat is hornier than the Twitch chat. How is this the case? Who made that happen? <laughs> I don't know. I don't MF know. 
I'm not even reading that shit. Dude, Mackie, I'm closing Discord, bro. <laughs> I'm fucking closing Discord. No. No, no, no. Oh my god. I'm not even gonna look. Lost. Gus, my toe's cold. Sorry, dude. Tits out for the mods. No, we don't. Okay. Haley, you started a really dangerous thing doing tits out for insert anything in here. Christ alive. Tits aren't even real. You guys can't fool me. They're not real. Dicks out in the mod chat. Well, no, let's... <laughs> I was sitting on the couch. A spider came down from the ceiling. Landed on my neck. I thought it was just an itch. So I tried to scratch an itch. I guess I hurt the spider because it bit me. No superpowers, just a welt. Oh, man, you got bit by one of the NPC spiders. Bullshit. Do you have the original Japanese Koga's ninja trick? No, I don't even know what the hell that is. What the hell? We got that freaking dog, dude. Put him on a leash. Zamazenta V. Try again. Tim, have a great rest of your evening. Thanks for joining us. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, two minute break, folks. I'll be right back. Lots more heat ahead. One sec. Da, da 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 Time to play. This one's too sad. Not this one. Silver Tempest. Let's go, baby. This is a banger. I agree, Gavin. Oh, I see something. Come on, baby. Uh, I don't think it's this, though. I think there's actually something in here. Yeah, there's something in here. There's something in here. I get bad, dude. When I when it's been a little while, I get a little peaky. Uh, excuse me, Dirk. Good to see you. You know I'm going to call you Dirk for the rest of your life, right? Good to see you, uh, Gromrel. Sigalif. Mistrevis. Whalmer. Murkrow. Emolga, Metatite, Toxapex. How come Trev L. Steinberg's not here for shit like that? That's got to be the prettiest V card ever. I like it. Ho oh, oh. That's one of those V cards that almost looks like. It's supposed to be an alt art or something. It's just so much of the Pokemon in there. Oh, baby, we're so back. Oh, I had this whole other tin. I didn't even realize I had. 
Welcome to not toy time, baby. Boink. I can't even get it out. Man, I wish we had some more baseball cards. That was fun. Mariadon. I had one Karaidon and one Mariadon tin out of that Costco thing. The first one was Mariadon. Beautiful. Alright, keep it cooking. I like when you do obscure TCGs. That is really fun. By the way, if any mods are around, I'd love to do a uh, channel toy bet for... War crimes. Here it is. Can we do a Desert Storm channel point bet, please? Uh, that'd be sick. No rush on it, though. I really appreciate it. Uh, let's go for the Dick Cheney. Let's go for the Colin Powell. Dare I say a little Saddam Hussein? I dare. Ba -ba -da. Thank you, Z. Appreciate you. <laughs> Ryan, yeah, 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 goes, please, I need some money. I'll go get Tim out of bed. Don't do it. Z's on it. Don't do it. You let Tim sleep. He has jokes to concoct inside of his cabeza. Leaf Green. Bramblin. Q-Fant. Krogunk. Shitoddle. Corviknight. Seviper. Paldean Tauros. Phalanx. Quaxly. And on the end, Squawkabilly EX. I can never get mad when I see Squawkabilly because it's such a ridiculous name and Pokemon, but bro, ain't worth shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? It ain't worth shit. Squawkabilly. Let's go, baby. Farkas, good to see you, dude. Hope y'all are well. Bop, 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 bop. Who doesn't love a parrot that plays stand-up bass? I mean, if you if you are encountering a parrot that plays stand-up bass and you don't like them, that's on you, buddy. I'm more of an electric. I'm more of a cello guy. I prefer uh, swallows that play the cello, aka swallow. All right, we're cooking. One fifty-one. About sit down base Gus I don't think my last message went through but I got some cool cards in from Japan and I posted them in the discord no way did you buy singles I guess I'll look right now <laughs> mods are degens Christ alive oh I see them over here oh those are pretty can we show them in the browser y'all mind Look at what Cider Main ordered from Japan today, guys. I'm going to set this one down. This is actually super cool. Bunch of singles. Look at these. Ooh, Squawkabilly. I see now why that tripped your memory there. We got a Squawkabilly in here. Uh, I see Ice Q. Oh, bro, got that Charizard. Okay, I think that's the chase for Paldean Fates, or... I don't remember. Maybe that's the Twilight Masquerade one. I see a Garchomp. That's beautiful. Also, whoa. Was that Hariyama? I don't recognize this one. Is this Galissapod? What the fuck? Maybe that's Hariyama. I do not recognize a lot of these. Gallade, Tyranitar? What the fuck? Is that that freaking spider? These are really new. Oh, it's the Obsidian Flames Zard. Okay, that tracks. That tracks. That's cool as hell. Second page, too. Look at this one, guys. Cidermain's always got some cool cards to show off, too. If you guys ever have any cool cards you want to show on screen, you can put them in the Discord here and just ask me. Just, just keep pinging me if I miss it. I see Entei. Suicune. Uh, that's that freaking... I don't know all the f past, future tense versions of these. But most of them are that. That's the Verizion. Oh, that's a pretty one. I like that one. I pulled this in English. Damn, those are cool. 
They're all scarlet, violet alts. Okay, good spread, dude. I like it. Also, by the way, channel point bet is up. You are betting which kind of guy, quote unquote, we're going to pull from the Desert Storm set pro set license from 1993 here. People include Dick Cheney, Colin Powell, Margaret Thatcher, Saddam Hussein. Get them in, fuckers. Oh, I don't doubt they look insane in person. I think that the Japanese color palette right now for the card prints are a little darker and deeper in uh, the Pokemon stuff than the English ones are. My god, that was an adventure. Dick or Colin had fallen off, so I had to look up the set list again. And in the short time since we last did War Crime Packs, the set list site is gone. Had to pull it up on Archive. That's no good. Uh, excuse me, the Japanese texture's on another level? You're damn right it is. Do, 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 do. Lightning. Drowsy. Bulbasaur. Dratini. Growlithe. Venomoth. Rapidash. Uh-oh, Gavin has a good feeling. Muck. Bill's transfer. It's a Raichu. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I didn't see it, Gavin. I didn't see it. Betting is now closed. Let's open up the Desert Storm packs over here. Let's see what we get. Storm and Norman. That's a good bet. I like that. I'll storm my norm. Who out there storming they Norman? Praying for disappointment. I need money. As you should. Nice and careful. Logan, don't you even fuck with me on that spider, bro. You're in trouble now, dude. What the hell? All right, let's see what we get. The guy is usually second to last, so I'm gonna move the last card up front, Kuwait. And now he's on the end. All right, looking out for that last card, Kuwait. This is one of the longest cards in the set. Multiple launch rocket system, MLRS. Latitude and longitude. US Constitution. Oof, let's go, brother. Let's go. Finland. Japan, FB111, Aardvark, Yellow Ribbons, tie a yellow ribbon round the old oak tree, the Chaplain's Corps, and on the end, <laughs> who is this fucking guy? <laughs> who the fuck is that guy? <laughs> what? Brian Mulroney? Who is this? Yeah, he does look like Jay Leno. Dude, I got a hankering for a, a specific strain of music right now, by the way. It's this. I don't know why. I just want it. Prime Minister of Canada. It's good. It's Brian Mulroney. Of course. H had I known. His face is too small for his head. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. But that's okay. Because, again, it takes all kinds. And I know you know this. Not an undercover cop. Hunter Biddy's Mulroney. He's just a fall guy. <laughs> Thank you, cop. I appreciate the biddies, dude. I want some bard core, dude. I just want a little bard core. Mackie bastard. <laughs> Shut up. More like Brian Baloney. Yo, Star Knuckle right here, dude. The short answer is no interesting guys. That's a no gang victory, and we're paying out accordingly. The points, of course, they flow like rain. Choose outcome. Some dumbass country does not get it. It's a none of them none of them situation congrats we will do more of those in fact i'm gonna re-rack one right fucking now dude so all the mods can bet dick or colon get them in bop, 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 bop. quick message Bop, 
ba 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 ba. Is this pumped up kicks but bard? What? No, it's an ancient hymn passed out through millennia. Do you guys hear this guy? <sighs> Logan goes, hey, can you guys keep it down? I'm trying to watch Game Boy Advance Shrek. I'm sorry, dude. Brother had it known. All the other kids with the pump. I mean, God is great. He lies this land and he's going to sow these oats. Close one. All the other kids with the pumped up kicks better run, better run. Oh, outrun my all oh, arrows or spears. Yeah, I can see it. Can can I promise no random screams to stream? I'd like to sleep. I know that's a lot to ask. I can promise my best intent. If I do it, it's involuntary. And also, I think it's unlikely, Sean. And that's a very fair thing to ask. Super fair to ask limit i can promise intent but not results that's okay pie roar we vile sit to 10 Ooh, see look how disciplined i was sean for the record uh. excuse me that's a first copraja mm. fun Cop Barrage is kind of dumb, though, right? I mean, it's a little bit dumb. Outside tent, no promises. Promises, no promises. Cop Barrage, uh, EX. It's pretty. Fuck or two. Still kind of fun, though. All right, betting is now closed. Desert Storm, let's see what else we get. Waving your banner all over the place. So for this one, we're looking for, or Hum Hum Hem is a good username. We're looking for Saddam Hussein. But we're opening like 10 different packs of Pokemon cards, uh, 10 different sets tonight, so. It'll change. We'd love a good Lugia, a good Giratina, a good Charizard. We'll see what happens tonight. Thanks for being here, by the way. Thank you, Or. We will stone you. <laughs> All right, I like. Yeah, I like that. That's a fucking good one. All right, let's see. What we get another Desert Storm. One more. What do we got on the end? Is it a dumb country? Is it Dick Cheney? Is it Colin Powell? Or is it some random guy? It's a, just a dumbass country. It's the UK, Governor. Hello, Governor. Aye. That's no good. <laughs> My points. Body, you're a young man, hard man, old man, stinky man, wet man, dry ass man. You got mud on your face, Silver Tempest. No, Gavin. <laughs> Friggin' dumbass kingdom imitation gruel gets it. Yo, we're getting goddamned hosed tonight. I'm sorry. We are so due after the success of last time's Pokemon pulls, though. But fucking hell, we're getting hosed. In fact, I already know there's not fucking shit in here. I know I said I wouldn't do that again. I'm no dumbass. There's not shit in there. 151. Come on, we gotta pull out the big guns. Big on time, baby. We got Shrek on Game Boy Advance and Bardcore All-Star? Come on. Tell me the pieces aren't there. Don't lie to me. Crazy talk. Wow. 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 
Yeah, I did. Jinx that shit in the title, dude. Wait, 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 wait. I'll unjinx it. I'm gonna change the title to... Only pulling very, very bad cards. I just changed the stream title because I had hits only and I was jinxing it, so I changed it to only pulling very, very bad cards. This ought to do it. This ought to do it. It's a cool place. A little late, my bad. Don't worry, guys, I'm only gonna pull really, really bad cards tonight. I'm not sacrificing Daisy, dude. She's the only heat I got, dude. She's my only hope. Okay, guys. Time to only pull very, very bad cards now. <laughs> it was just one. It was just one. Okay. It was just one. Didn't count. No hollering. Sean's trying to go to bed. Guys, quit your yapping. It's okay. Chilling rain. Set herself up for a challenge. So much to do, so much to see. So what's wrong with taking the back streets? You never know if you don't go. You never shine if you don't glow. New or old? Old! And good. At least a hollow. Let's see what we get. One, two, three, four. Come on, baby. Chilling rain. At least a hollow. Come on, baby. Clara. Haunter. Flannery. Heracross. Clubopus. Grookey. Galarian Farfetch'd. Cast form rainy form. Oh, God damn it. Chilling rain may be the worst hit rate set ever, though, so I'm not too bummed. Oh. I'm certainly not surprised. Cubone and ditto, double Q pack, I agree. <sighs> that one hurt. Wait, fuck Silver Tempest, dude. Fusion Strike. It's Mew Year. Let's go. Dude, the viewership this week, let's fucking go, by the way. Thanks for being here, everybody. Concurrent peak. Let's go, baby. One, two, three, four. Very do. Fire, Thonsparce, Cramomatic, Lapras, Smeargle, Carvana. I don't know why Sweet Dreams Are Made of These is the loudest song on the playlist. Wait, that's bad. Oops. Not an undercover cop. 100 biddies, dude. We getting out of the moat with this one. <laughs> Bro. Why, God? That's a good bit. I like that bit. Thank you, cop. I had to turn it down a little bit. I got scared. No, we don't take those, dumbass. I think the real problem is Ted's not here. I'm going to double tap a fusion strike. Come on, dog. Wumpus out here 30 months. Wumpus, Grumpus, Wumpus, Grumpus, Wumpus, Grumpus, Wumpus, Grumpus. Several times over at the end parentheses. Rare quality. Good meme in the Discord today, Grumpus. How are you? Thanks for the... How many is that now? Fucking 30? Goddamn, bro. Well, I guess they packaged this one backwards, but it's at least a hollow. Good to know. Thank you, Wumpus Grumpus. Happy Tuesday. Dude, I'm fantastic. Love you, big guy. I'm glad you're doing well, dog. Let's go. Captain Nemo goes, Wumpus, parentheses, real. Ooh, the pipes are done. DVD time. What part are we at in Shrek, by the way? I'm looking right now. I can't tell. Whoa, that's off center. And on the end. What? Oh! That's the worst kind of error pack. It's supposed to be at least a hollow, and it's not even a fucking holographic rare. Well, that's a bummer. 
My discovery flight is booked. Journey to the PPL is real. Let's go, dude. Up top. Boop. I hope the trip goes well. Good journeys, good flights, brother. Thank you so much for the prime sub. Cheers to you. More like Badra? Brother, you said it. Moving on. Silver Tempest is send it. Oh, he's at Fiona's tower trying to rescue her. It is getting kind of intense then. You're right. Sweet dreams are made of this. Is it this or these? Who had a mind to take a piss? It feels strong, man. I like that. That's more reassuring. <clears throat> Metal, Hypno, Punch Crow, Ninetales, Ralts, Crow Gunk, Solosis, Zubat, Fungus, Don Fan. Can I ask you something real quick? God bless. Um, so I get. So where are the hits? Any of them. Any. Top card of the night's fucking five bucks. Open 20 packs. Mid. Mackie, unfortunately, out of spite, I threw away the entire stack. I don't even know where it is, unfortunately. I'm sorry. I'll get another one. Lost Origin. Come on, dude. But remember, remember. Also, Elkaz, how are you, dude? I got you. You're welcome in advance. Bro, you blessing this next pack? Elkaz is making this be the Giratina. I promise. I promise. <laughs> the confidence of you're welcome in advance to call a fucking hit. I love that. Dude. Ah, oh, sticky. <laughs> it is done. Okay, nothing but heat. Here we go. Ba -ba -ba Boom. Hey, Gus, I'm trying to learn from my son. Why do Pokemon players shuffle the first three or four cards after opening each pack? Good question, Med City CPA. Um, so basically, and it's not the same for every single pack or set of Pokemon cards. If you do it for a while, you, you begin to learn which ones you're supposed to do it to. But especially for me who's like presenting them for content i like to position the best possible hit card in the very back to build anticipation in fact check this out there's nothing in this pack probably squovit damage pump is so funny beautifly i mean that's a hollow it's the best one it's at the back so i'll tell you right now med city let's do this chilling rain pack if I just open this regularly, I'm not going to do the pack trick. Ordinarily, I would, for this pack, put four to the front. Because right now, the rare card, whatever it is, is in the middle of the pack. And I'm glad that they do that, that they don't put them on the edges, because it's just one extra layer of security. If, like, the rare rare card was on this side or this side, there's a potential it could get scratched and dinged up. It doesn't ma matter what happens to these outside ones. But the potential rare one's in the middle. So let's just, without doing the pack trick, flip to it now. Here's the reverse Grookey. And on the end, Obama Snow. So that's a rare, as indicated by a star. Nothing there. But that's basically uh, why we do that. Some packs are, like, four to the front. Some are three to the front. Uh, the most recent ones are usually one to the front. In fact, let's open a recent one. Uh, it would be this one, 151, which is also a good pack, by the way. Wishing you all the best if you decide to start opening with your family, though. Mackie, that's okay. We'll find it along the way, dude. One to the front. So now I just put the energy card on the front for the newest one, and the hot ones are in the back. Fire energy. Geodude. Jigglypuff. 
Staryu, Charmander, Raticate, Erica's Invitation, Magneton, Dodrio, Spiro. Boys, we're getting hosed. We're getting hosed. Hosed tonight. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> the music's killing your pull rates? That's true. I think it is. Music suggestions. What are we putting on? I can't do copyright stuff, but I can do video game things and anything like that. What do you guys got? Reorganize these here. Anything other than this, please? Yeah, it's, it, it's not exactly the vibe. I'll put this on as a placeholder. Delta 9, this is for you, bro. Let's go. This is for Delta. Alarm goes off at 7. Ooh, I like this. In fact, I'm gonna go pee, leave this up, I'll be right back. One second. Sounds pretty good, eh? I like the music. It definitely hits. Zumbini baby goes, I'm so sick, and I went to the store, and a guy waited until I got back in my car and closed the door before he went in. I must look as awful as I feel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> that card being called Daisy's Help is low-key and insane choice. Yeah, it's kind of wild. Kind of wild. If you haven't listened to slash watch the Post Malone Pokemon 25 concert... It is something so special. No way. I didn't even know he did that, dude. I'll have to check it out. This is a great one. Shrek 1 DVD goes, Hey, Gus, which is your favorite Shrek movie? Well, basic answer, number one. I like it. I like it. It's just number one. I mean, one and two are the best. That's so clear. I think I honestly like them in the order that they were created. In descending order. One's the best, two's the second best, three's the third best. Four exists. You know what I mean? I'm looking forward to the new one, though. B -b -b Boom. Natarok, thank you. If you hit exclamation point rager, you can see a little teaser trailer of the game over there. Thanks for asking. I really appreciate it. I got you. Same here, Gus. Shrek 1's my favorite, too. Thanks for the answer. You bet, Shrek 1 DVD. It's a great one. It's just so classic. 
I'm always a proponent of movies that are just like simple and profound, you know? No dressing up, cool, simple concept, simple set pieces, cool characters. I like it. Shrek 1 VHS though, who else, dude? Yup. Last time I watched Shrek 1, it was on VHS. I need something out of here. There's something in here fucking finally, bro. Imagine I get the loogie out of this one. I think this might be a double banger, frankly. I'm not joking. Oh, boys, boys, boys. I can't tell. Can't tell. Puss in Boots is also really good, though. Puss in Boots. I Probably every single Puss in Boots movie is better than anything after Shrek 2. Yes! Finally, we're back on it. Okay, Radiant Alakazam. Okay, I'll take it. I will take it. I love, dude, the origin story Shrek 1 DVD. S tier. What else we got? Alec of Lamb, baby. Oh! Now. <laughs> I got that freaking fossil there, guy. Ski Scoots goes, uh, I think the last time I watched Shrek 1, it was on a portable DVD player in the back of a minivan. It's kind of the way to watch it, frankly. Almost RV. Technical double banger pack. Not even technical, really, but I'm just saying more of a technical happy situation, you know? There we go. Yeah, Alakazam is cool, though. That's a sick card. Ba -ba -ba boom It's something. You always think of the Simpsons aliens with that Pokemon? That's a good comparison. I like that. Start a prediction. Dick colon. Two minutes on the clock. We're doing another war crimes bet, boys. Get them in. Probably the best Radiant I've ever seen. I agree. Yo! Oh my god. Bittersweet, dude. Last fucking pack of the Renderman Desert Storm cards. Oh my god. Get your bets in. Extra, extra, dude. Last time we're going to be able to do this bet for a long time. Damn. I mean, that's a bummer. Yeah, the legitimate end of an era. I didn't realize. Okay, last Desert Storm bet for a while. I mean, I still have the yellow ones here. These. I got a lot of these. You know? This isn't even part of the bet. I got a lot of these, but I mean, there's no... There's just the Dick Cheney, Cole, and Powell tag teams in these. Horner. They're still cool. Gus, this is probably all for naught, because a gentleman like you has probably already seen it. But I would submit that 1990's Tremors is a perfect movie. Perfect in every way, from cinematography to a tightly written script, it has pathos and action, romance and comedy, and Kevin Bacon. And Fred Ward make a dynamic duo on par with Bob and Doug McKenzie. You should watch it. I'm going to tell you the truth right now, Logan, because first of all, I love the message. I am not joking. Have not seen Tremors. Hand to God. Haven't seen it. I clearly, based on your comment, am in for a treat. I will watch it this week. You're in for a treat, sir. <laughs> I love that, dude. I am in for a treat, sir. I hope it's good. Thank you very much for the comment. I appreciate that, Logan. I will check it out. I'm trying to watch some classic Halloween movies that I've not yet gotten to this year. That's my goal. So I'm going to add Tremors to that list. I know it's not the most Halloween-y. It's more action-adventure thriller. I think I'll like it, dude. Tremors is amazing. Well, I look forward to it. Find it on VHS. I will try. All right, guys. Are you ready for maybe the last ever Desert Storm Saddam Hussein card potential? 
Again, thank you, Renderman. We've probably gotten four streams worth of enjoyment out of these packs that you sent in. Uh, bittersweet right now, guys. Mandatory eyes up moment. One to the front. Last chance for the Saddam Hussein card. France goes to the front. Okay, now we'll see what we got. That's kind of funny. Scott Tarr, bro, good to see you. Sorry you've been absent. No worries, dude. Tomahawk cruise missile. This is so bittersweet. Some dumbass tank. Chronology of events. Is France a land? No, France is not real. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. It's not real. Cuba Meat goes, when I was around 12 years old, I watched Tremors once or twice a week for a year. I loved it so much. I like it. Czechoslovakia. Holy shit. First of all, just in this one pack, we've already gotten France, Czechoslovakia, and Austria. A lot of places. F-15 Eagle. Women in Combat. Two more. United Service Organization. Last chance. Maybe ever to pull the Saddam Hussein card. Maybe ever. Let's see what we get. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Oh, Canada. What the fuck is this? Oh. Oh, Ensign, good to see you, Dirk. Dumbass, Delta, oh. Okay, that freaking stinks. God damn it, that's a huge bummer. Huge bummer. None of them. Doesn't even count as some dumbass country because it's like the anthem. We already clarified this before. It's like, it's got to be like just dead nuts Austria or Belgium, you know? Ugh, stupid. That's a bummer. Really wish I could have been wrong on that one. Durf, I get you, dude. These things happen. That's okay. Astral Radiance. Keep them cooking. We need fucking something other than this stupid Daisy's help card. Come on. This is this is next level nuts right now. What the fuck is going on, dude? What are we doing? Come on. Some nights are like this, though. I mean, really, our luck from the other night was probably like three or four nights worth of hits, so I kind of can't gripe, but still, at the same time, dog... Dude, Lynx, uh, that's what I'm saying, Lynx, bro. You're right. It's just like, okay, this is just the universe seeking equilibrium. I'm not surprised. Ralts, a, su a Sui and Sneasel. Oh, no. Oh, no. Man, Gavin, especially, I know this is like your first time chilling through if you're here from Instagram. I wish you could have seen last stream. It was just like off the fucking chain wild. We probably had, I'd say at least 10 cards over 10 bucks. We have one card worth five bucks right now. Not good. So I'm in here. Check it out. What? Okay, I won't do it again. <laughs> I just I just really thought it's on edge. I will not do it again. I'm sorry. Hand to God. Hand to God. We're good. Honey. Okay. Okay. I think we have to do a honey sacrifice, legally speaking. It's not even me talking. I mean, it's just a precedent, right? I know the rules. Honey sacrifice rules. We've done this for three years. So basically, we are going to put this poor, impressionable young card up for sacrifice. If we pull a holographic, a regular one with her, she lives. But she has to go again right away. If we get a V card or better, she's good. She gets to survive. If we get a very, very good card, she gets sleeved and ascended into Valhalla. But if she gets no hollows, 
I don't want to say it. Well, we're going to rip her to shreds. So we're going to put her into defense mode. Oh, no. There's a channel point bet on her life, too. Sacrifice defense mode back here. I'm scared. Get your channel point bets in. Ooh. Will Honey survive? Please get him in. You got a minute on the clock. I'm scared. In fact, I'm going to give this one in terms of, like, choosing power to somebody that I trust in chat. Which pack is going to determine Honey's fate? I'm only going to pick a couple. I'm going to give this one to Delta 9. Going to need your input on this one, Delta. Which one is Honey going to buy for here? We got Silver Tempest, Crown Zenith, Lost Origin, Chilling Rain, and Fusion Strike. Now, don't answer yet. I I know, oh no, bro. <laughs> Whenever you're ready, will we play for Honey's Life on number one, Silver Tempest? Number two, Crown Zenith. Number three, Lost Origin. Number four, Chilling Rain. Or number five, Fusion Strike. You take all the time in the world, preferably under two minutes. What do you think, Delta? One, two, three, four, five. Which one's going to determine her fate? Bro, scared. I'm only listening to Delta on this one. I know Delta's scared. <laughs> Wumpus goes, if you mess this up, we have to kill you, Delta. Delta's like, whoa, dude. <laughs> Yo, bro. What the fuck? Sorry, man. I don't think you're sorry. I think you're pretty proud. <laughs> Wag Wagger goes, number one, my lord. <laughs> Delta goes five, but I'm scared. Okay, good, good answer. So the coward's way out would have been to choose Crown Zenith because the hit rates are fucking great. The bravest of brave man ways out would have been to choose Chilling Rain because it's terrible hit rates. So bro went right down the middle with number five, Fusion Strike. No second to last card, but still okay hit rates. Let's see what we got. I'm scared. I'm just going to tell you right now. 50 Acres. We're starting the TCG Sim tomorrow. I'm excited. Remember, if, if we get a holographic, a regular holo, it's a re-rack. Non-holo, kill honey. V or better, she lives. Excellent card, sleeved, hard cased, and she gets sent to Valhalla where she may die among her peers. <sighs> Rerack is this knob? Scott, you're making me smile, bro. You're making me smile. Miss me some knob, dude. Okay. Leaf green. Epra, sim tomorrow, bro. I'm excited. Judge. Oh my god. Delta's the judge. Excadrill. Trevenant, don't do it. Don't do it to me. Come on, dog. I'm scared. Clam Pearl. Ooh. More Peko. I need a little less Peko. Preferably fewer Pekos. Skarmory. Okay. Okay. Shelmet. Little Plusle. Okay. Reverse. Is a pan pour. Delta, you accept responsibility, don't you? This needs to be a V card or better. Epirus! Oh my god, dude. <sighs> Talking about muddying the morality waters here. Epirus, holy Christ, just subbed up 10 people. Bro, my heartbeat is already through the fucking roof. This is probably the only honey bed of the evening. I'm scared. Epirus just subbed up 10 people, by the way. First of all, big fat thank you to Epirus. See how careful I'm going to be on the corners here? I did not peek. You saw me avert my eyes. I didn't want to get spoiled. I want to see it right with you off the presses. Group cheers, guys, right before the storm here. Calm before the storm. Very fitting for the U.S. Swing the sip around. You guys take a sip. Cheers, cheers. 
Thank you, Epris. You got subbed up by any of the 10 from Epris. Please be sure to say thank you. Cheers from Reno. Cheers from Ski Scoot. Cheers from Logan. Fuck yeah. Gavin doing the cheers. Thank you, dude. I really appreciate that, Epris. Thank you so very much, dude. I hope you're having a great night. I'm scared. Delta needs a beer better. Stop, bro. Stop. Dude, be still my beating heart, dude. Woo! Hey, Jesus Christ. Oof. I, dude, I've been so disciplined with the edges on this one too, Epirus. I ain't peeking. I know you know it. Crabtronics goes, ooh, Epirus going hard in the paint right now. I need a little leaf green. Fan my ass off, Epirus. Thank you, dude. Invisit cheers to you. Thank you very much, Epirus, for fucking 20 subs. Love you, bro. That helps. Thank you. <laughs> uh, five subs. If it's hollow or better, this is not an undercover cop. Five subs if it's hollow or better. Bro chose a hard deck to pull it out of, too, by the way. I'll do it. I'm not. Okay. Okay. I know. Okay. I'm scared. I'm just scared. Thank you, cop. Thank you, Epirus, so very fucking much, bro. Appreciate it. All right, Delta. Honey's fate in three, two, one. Oh, my God, dude. <laughs> No way, okay. Oi! Oi! Never again, frankly. Never. Whoa, 10! Bro, thank you! Holy shit! We just got like 30 subs in the last 45 seconds. Oh, Delta, we won. Serena V. Wow. Dude, one thing away from a hype train. That hype train hits. That fucker's going to be on level three to start. I guarantee it right now. I guarantee it right now. It's got to be somebody else. Ep dude, Epris with another tight fiver. Thank you, dude. Oi. Honey's alive. She lives to pray another day, brother. Oh my god, <laughs> my god, dude. dude, I was nervous, we've been getting hosed all night, Serena V, there we go, saves it, Gus clarified that's a survive, not an ascend, it's not a, it's not an ascend, but it's not a re-rack, it's only a re-rack if it's a regular ass holographic, okay, nice and easy, not an undercover cop, 100 more biddies, dude, Epirus and I watching like proud parents, <laughs> Now you guys are empty nesters, dude. Oh, Christ. Scott Tar starting the hype train with us, too. Thank you, Scott Tar, so much for subbing up. Mix Master 27, bro. I appreciate that. Level 7! What? We started the hype train on the single biggest fucking number of the night. That's wild, bro. How many honeys have ascended to, to Valhalla in four years, Gavin? There have been three honeys that have ascended to Valhalla. Three of them. It's hard to do. You got to get like a secret rare or an alt art on those. Those are crazy. Again, I personally appreciate it. Epirus, not an undercover cop. All of our sub bombers, but most recently you too. Thank you. That means a lot to me. That fucking helps me out. If you guys got subbed up by any of these bombers, please be sure to say thank you. I don't know what to say. Appreciate it. Uh, Sorry for the burps. You see, I'm doing my best out here. In fact, we're popping champs, bro. 20 seconds. No screens. champs of course i mean this champ ain't of beers cheers epirus cheers not an undercover cop Ooh, quite tasty 
grog time? I wish. Don't worry, I already tried grog in the United States, bitch. Early access, motherfucker. You don't pre-order games, but you pre-order drinks. It's just the rule of the land. Espresso Rat, 100 bitties, bro. Thank you, dude. Appreciate you, Espresso Rat. Thank you, thank you. We live in the Miller High Life tonight. <laughs> yeah, we are, dude. Whew, that scared me. All right, honey lives to survive another day. Let's go. We might have to bring her out if things get rough, okay? We will take honey out if things get rough, because I am not fucking comfortable at all yet. We just barely dodged a bullet. I wish you the best, friend. Same to you, Epris. I hope the week goes well for yourself. Again, tomorrow we're going to be starting the TCG Shop Simulator with the Pokemon card mod. All I'm saying is, I'm excited. Oop, don't like that pull. There we go. I'm excited. Thank you guys, though, really so much. Cop, Epris, bro, you guys fucking rock. Thank you for doing that, dude. Let's fucking go. Three uncles in voice chat right now. I have been told by my by my legal advisors to never join voice chat for the public discord on stream anymore. I will respect that ruling. Deli Bird, we got far fetched. Names Twister, still getting subbed up over here. Still going off. Sobble. We got Malamar. Anything on the end? It's a freaking. That's actually a walrus, dude. That actually is not good. The freaking crap. Oh man, Epris, I see your message and I know it's been going on, dude. I I, I hope that's a, a meme or a jest, but if not, bro, you know we got your best, dude. I'm sorry. Hope everything's going well as much as you can, dude. Ugh, wild fucking time, right, dude? Nothing but love at you too. In fact, I don't want to be misconstrued into thinking that it's just like love equals subs or anything. I don't need any more. In fact, don't give me any more for a while, dude. Nothing but love to you. I just hope you and your family's doing well. I don't need shit from you, bro. You're good for life. Um, I hope everything's going well. I'm sorry if stuff's been going bad. I just don't want it to be uh, twisted or anything, you know? Like, you gotta take care of you and yours first. So you focus on that if that's the case. I just know you've already spoken on that previously is all. I'm a man of the people. I feel like Russell Crowe. Also, love to Epirus. Exactly. Love to Epirus from Undercover Cop and everybody else. Wumpus Crumpus, we love you, dude. Absolutely, Wumpus. Um, thank you, Cop. I appreciate that very much. Yeah, bro, you're good, Epirus. You're fucking good for life, dog. Um, Reno's extending some love as well. Gavin extending some love. There's a good group of folks over here. You know, we're, we like, it sounds like such a meme. We like to have fun around here and stuff. We're having fun. I appreciate that this is a place where people can share the highs and lows. And I appreciate it all the same. You know, you got to share when you're hurt and you got to share when you're excited. So it's a good, good place to come and congregate with stuff like that. Haley's extending some love too. How are we all feeling tonight too? By the way, we I'd say probably another 20, 30 minutes to stream over here. Like I said, I was doing about... Three to four hours. I think we're going to cap out at about three, 310 or so. We're, we're getting work done. We're getting work done. Epirus, love you all. Love to you too, dude. It's a goofy group of really kind people here. It turns out it is. It is. And now don't go saying tits out for this group of people because keep them locked. Not loaded, but locked. Gushers are, gush uh, are gushing slim. Thank you. Liquid Hot Ranch goes noise, noise indeed. Um, I just want to extend my appreciation for that hype train too. That was very kind of you guys. Thank you again, Epirus and, and Cop. You guys are good. You're good. Tits in for love. Reno goes genuinely the best and most welcoming and wholesome online community I've ever found. I appreciate that, Reno. I'm glad that you enjoy your time here. We enjoy having you. We really do. Packages going out tomorrow. Want anything from the Albany store? Oh, man. Dealer's choice, brother. I'll be excited for anything, Cider Man. Thank you for the ask. Um, I'm, I'm stoked. I swung by the P.O. box today, and I got a little letter in it that said, uh, please update your payment information. So I did. I figured it wasn't a package that was worth uh, opening on stream because then I'd have to share my credit card details. M maybe, maybe next time. <laughs> 
Unless you guys want to see. All right, write them down. Card number is one, two, three, four. You guys writing this down? Four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, nine, 10, 11, 12. Write them down. You, you know, you sent that? Okay. <laughs> yeah, it was wrapped in an Amazon package box too, by the way. It had Amazon tape on it. It said, I opened it up. Please update your card information. I said, oof. That's the password to my luggage. Oh, Benji, pa I'm sorry. Yeah, guys, nobody try that on any luggage, please. Leave the carousel. Get in the Uber. Don't do it. That'd be such a funny prank if you just showed us your credit card. <laughs> All right, fine. Here it is. Um, it's. Hope you wrote that down. Hope you wrote it down. I like that we can fuck around and check in with each other here. I love you guys. I've really been enjoying streams in the last couple weeks, especially. D dude, last year, this this year has been so fun for me. And stream has been exclusively a place of, like, peace and enjoyment. I'm really sorry that I haven't, like, fixed my microphone or had a better schedule or been playing, like, the best practices of games to get as many people in here as possible. But if anything, that's a testament to how I've been personally feeling, where I've had ups and downs and stuff, but... Overall, I've just been feeling a lot more comfortable with myself, realigned with, like, what's a good priority in my life, and just, like, I, I, I mean, I've been working my ass off. I don't need, I know I don't even need to, like, prove it to you folks. Like, I'm doing five videos a week here, months in now, doing the game work, doing stand-up, being here for my brother, my girlfriend, my buddies and shit. Tomorrow's another shoot day. Like, I've been feeling good, so. Worst practices, ironically, are an indication of, like, I feel good, you know? I don't feel like I need to streamline my life. I like that I can show up here at the end of the night and be like, fuck it, we're playing itch. Or like, fuck it, I'm playing Samuros for two hours. Or fuck it, I'm opening cards and stuff. It's just like, who's here is here. I love it. I appreciate folks tuning in. So, Slim, yeah. Lynx, yeah. Cop, Gavin, Reno. We like the janky stuff. I live a tape together lifestyle and I ain't afraid to say it. Brian goes, I'm not the most active, but whenever I pop in, it's like therapy. Dude, you are active and we love you for it, Ryan. Thanks for swinging through. If you ever come to Denver, I'll come dressed as a cop. Maybe a sexy one. Ooh. <laughs> Show up at like a Denny's and they're like, we can't seat you. There's a ch there's a children's birthday party occurring over there in the entire B section. We can't seat you. It's 6 p.m. Cop goes, ah, seat me. And they're like, no, we like, again, we can't do that. We can't. Thank you, Haley. Um, I'm going to go pee quick. And then let's just keep opening cards and having a nice time, okay, guys? It's probably another half hour or so. I'll be right back.
Oh, you guys are here? Oh. We... Okay, back to work, I guess. <laughs> you can't see an officer of the law. What the hell? Play Freebird? Is that it? Uh, Silver Tempest, time to get a Lugia. Oh, would you look at that? I am where everybody knows my name. You too? What the hell? Go card. One, two, three, four to the front. Here we go. A little fire red. Let's see what we get. Silver Tempest. Come on, dog. I would love an Alolan Vulpix, by the way. That'd be cool. Quadstone. Also, I skipped the Denny. It's lovely to see him. I don't want to talk to him right now. I'm kind of scared of him, frankly, after the last update. Dreepy. Vulpix. Emolga. Chimeco. Buneary. Ferrothorn. And on the end, it's a Victini. Victini is cool, and I always like his cards. But they're never really too valuable. I'd love a nice S-tier Victini kind of card, you know? What are you guys up to tomorrow? What do folks have going on? I got a full meme shoot day tomorrow. I'm going to try to get here for the evening so we can play TCG Shop Simulator. Gavin's got some school. Sounds good. Probably a few folks in here got school at least. Ooh, wow. Now that's interesting as a motherfucker. And I'm going to be really well behaved. But... I see a quite interestingly coded card, so I'm going to have to request formally that the chat puts its eyes up right. Oh, guys, put your eyes up. I'm not fucking around. Put your eyes up. I I saw a sliver. I don't know for sure. I think we got the, the golden Rayquaza. I, I'm, I'm just going to be really blunt with you. I think we got the golden Rayquaza in here. Okay. Delta's working. Volleyball playoffs. Good luck tomorrow, Emerald. Let's go. Start of my weekend, Cidermane. Fuck yeah. Early morning run, grad school, and some Bible study. There you go, cop. Full day. Trip with my family to the Redwoods. That's going to be awesome, dude. That's going to be fucking sick, Reno. Send pics in the Discord if you'd like. Working just one of my lunch, ba lunch break. Wahoo. There we go. Also, I'm actually not joking. I, I just saw a sliver of the edge. A sliver. And uh, that's the guy that killed Fugitive's wife. Hey, inside joke. And uh, I'm, I'm not certain, but I'm like 90% sure that there's the fucking gold Rayquaza in here right now. I'm not joking. Come on. Come on. Squove it. I, I think it is. I think it is. I'm not going to yell. I'm not going to blow up the speakers. I think that's what's in here. Okay? Sudowoodo. Bronzor. <gasps> even better. Oh my god, I'm not gonna yell. Even fucking better. Oh my god. That. Mm. I promised Sean I was not gonna yell tonight. That's big. Yep. Love it. Fuck oh, yes. That was so overdue. Same framing too as the uh, rainbow one from Vivid Voltage, of which we are opening none tonight. That's five dollars and thirty-four cents. Uh, okay. <laughs> First of all, I was like totally right on the gold card though, because I saw the black on the edge, and I was like, ah, that's that's something. And I really thought that it was. I, I guess I got it confused. I guess the gold Rayquaza is in Silver Tempest, and this was a Lost Origin pack. Still great. 
<laughs> you don't put that away. My girlfriend watches the stream. Dude, don't show her. Hide the screen. Go audio only for a little while. This is just a regular slow, bro. <laughs> Saved you. There we go. I mean, it's still fucking sick. Isn't that crazy, too, by the way, that that's the s second best card of the stream tonight? How is this dumb fucking card better than this card? I just, I don't make it make sense. You know what I mean? Oh, uh, excuse me. I maybe got seven packs left, and we're at the point where we need one juggernaut to make this stream worth it from a financial perspective. Again, good vibes, good subs, nothing but love, no gripes. But just from cold, hard pull rate stuff, we need a juggernaut at this point, dude. Gus, you know why? Wait, 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 why? I'm missing something. I probably do know why. Because I didn't pray. I thought that card said daddy's help. I was a little concerned, dude. It might. I did get three alts left last time. I mean, last time was like three streams worth of luck. Again, dude. Yeah, I know why the girl's more expensive than the two. I didn't. I'm sad because of that. <laughs> but that's okay. Okay, Crown Zenith. Let's see what we get out of here. Good hit rates. Not insane value. If we got a gold card out of here, that'd be crazy. I see a V-Star. That's okay. Mimilati, you want Un Mas pull? We're going to get you Uno Mas pull, bro. Shaman. Also, I am really happy about that gold Pikachu, though. It's just not, like, as insane as I thought it was potentially going to be. Aaron, Cricket Thought. Seal Baltoin on the end. It was just the V-Star. I saw a little splash of color. I thought it was something. It was a V-Star. That's okay. You know what's some exciting uh, bit that I'm going to eat with my meal tonight? This is really interesting, I assure you. I'm going to eat a Trader Joe's arugula lemon basil vinaigrette salad kit. Purchased for only $3. Serves three. Not the flex. Guys, you know me, humble Gus Johnson, sketch maker, uh, internet extraordinaire. Not the brag, but I'm going to eat the three dollar Trader Joe's lemon basil arugula uh, vinaigrette salad kit tonight. Also, I'm saying it's not lettuce, Dimitri. It's frick. It's lettuce adjacent. It. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's lettuce. <laughs> arugula is not my favorite. Dude, I like arugula with lemon is really good, too. It's pretty much freaking dandelion leaves, dude. Those are fun. Three dollars. Three dollars is good if it serves three. It's a big bag. Because also, it's not just arugula in there and dressing. It's like arugula, dressing, sliced carrots, sliced radish. Uh little sliced cabbage in there ban the horse <laughs> yo not even joking that's the first fucking time i've seen somebody do that ban the horse the big boy leaf green blown up like that that actually looks fucking sick as hell giant like that thanks for doing it excuse me bro you got the rabbit dinner at petco what i'm sorry dimitri what i do to deserve this freaking crap though is the thing Nah, I'm just playing, dude. I'm actually over it. I'm not even... Just so you know. I just want you to know what we're working with over here, Dimitri. Cop is doing the big leaf green. Ironic from a cop, for the record. Thank you, not an undercover cop. Don't! You can't bring group chat shit into the fucking Twitch chat. Raymundo Rocket? Leave it in Boris. Dirty play. Oh, good. Moon Man Stan summon up. Let's fucking go. 14 months. Good to see you. Well, it's good to see you too, Moon Man Stan. I hope things are going better with you, dude. Thank you, Moon Man. Dirty. Dirty moves. Thank you, Moon Man Stan. Thank you again, cop. Little fuckers. Little fuckers. 
I ain't no snitch, brother. You better not be. In K. Ooh, Poliwhirl. That's kind of cool. That's a freaking stray dog. Can't convince me otherwise. Nothing. Shrek ended twice. Oh, no. We've been going that long. It's only 85, 90 minutes, though. I'm not too surprised. Shrek's going to start. Look, Shrek will start over again. Watch this. If I do that. And then boom. Oh, wait. No, that's right. I forgot we set up the gift so that the Game Boy one doesn't start over. But the pipe screen does start over. It's kind of funny. Well, enjoy your pipes. No more DVDs. Not an undercover cop. Thanks for the biddies. Who's the narc? Are you? Legally, bro, you have to tell me. I'm off my gourd right now. <laughs> if somebody admits that they're off their gourd legally, I don't need to tell them shit. Imagine a cop pulls you over and goes like this. Roll your window down. Hi, officer. Can I help you? Do you know how I pull you over tonight? I'll just beat you dub skis. I'm off my gourd right now. You can just drive away. Like, you can actually just, like, put it into neutral, put it into drive, shift the clutch. You can go on your way. Just so you guys know. A little legal help over here. 151. Heater card coming in. Uh. Can I make a prediction? Oh. War turtle in here. War turtle. Love it. All right, guys, I got to hit the hay. I wish you all well. I hope you pull some more hits tonight and try to catch the next stream. But till then, shameless plug, follow me on IG Red Hoodie Kid 2. Oh. Have a good night, Gavin. Sorry for the burps. Have a good day tomorrow. Got to be on your guard, dude, all day. Not wrong. That's how I avoided the incident in 97. Cop, you get it, dude. Thanks for the bits all night, dude. Cop, you've been hype as shit. I appreciate the bits and the bits. Know what I'm saying? All right, 151. Let's see. War turtle in here. I'm telling you, I feel it. Paris. Voltorb. Krabby. Sandshrew. Sandslash. Nidarino. Gold Duck. Tentacool. Gyarados. And on the end. Oh, we got mimed. Oy. It's a bad, bad ETB. <laughs> it's no good. Last ETB, though, was, like, kind of god mode. Bro, I got a beer in one hand and a crustable in the other. We're watching Pokemon. Life is good. Briscoe, life is fucking good, dude. That's a that's a great little slice of existence right there. Beer, uncrustable Pokemon. Boom. I wish every minute of every day could be that. Uh, Briscoe, where do you think the hit is here? Three packs left in the whole stream. One, Lost Origin. Two, Crown Zenith. Three, 151. Briscoe, what are we pulling here? Where's the hit? What do you got, dog? Spin Haley goes, I am baked ZD as fuck myself. Dude, there you go. Cheers. Briscoe goes, gotta be 151. I agree with the Briscoe. All right, let's get some heat at the end of the night. Thanks for being here, nobody, Briscoe. Here we go. One. There we are. Oh, cool. It's a hollow. Last 151 pack. Pokemon streams are a treat. I appreciate you guys letting me do it and helping me do it. Thanks for being here. Tomorrow will be TCG Shop Simulator Pokemon Mod Edition after a long shoot day. I don't know when I'm going to get on right now or for tomorrow, though. So just a heads up. Could be a little late. My apologies. I'm trying to film with seven people tomorrow. And I think we're probably cumulatively going to shoot like 12 sketches. So I'll keep you posted on Instagram and Discord here, okay? Swirl. 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 Three swirler. Let's go. Cop, is that the moon, <laughs> bro? It is now. Thanks for the biddies, dude. Thank you, Undercover Cop. Big Green. Big Baby Green. Bellsprout. Magikarp. Oddish. Have a good night, Wampus, by the way. I love you too, bro. Have a great evening. Victory Bell. Big Air Balloon. Briscoe. Let's see what we get here, dude. Last three. Cycling Road. 
Big air balloon again, and it's, oh no, we got hosed with the Chansey. Oh, it's okay. Bellsprout is beautiful, did not notice that before. I like it. Cap Nima goes by Wumperino. The old Wumperino. I'm gonna do a crown zenith over here. I think we'll get a little heat there. Chansey got two big air balloons, if you know what I mean. Can you stop talking about the breasts of my friends? I'm gonna cut you off. You're getting cut off. Mods banned Dimitri. Thank you. God bless. Terrible luck, still a fun stream. Hey, I mean, there's still a chance for two heaters. Not likely. Bad luck, good chats. It's it's weird, because, like, I also enjoyed the last Pokemon stream, and we were getting, like, hand over fist luck. And I'm enjoying this one. Like, there is no difference in the actual enjoyment level for me right now, but the hit percentage is, like, fucking wildly different right now, dude. The breast of my friends, sick bad name, dude. Yeah, right? Breast of my friends, given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Pawniard. Tangrowth. We're getting cooked. We're getting cooked. How could this have happened? How could this have happened? In a word, crazy. Very wild. Mad wild. Last pack magic. You think we got it? Do you guys have faith? Come on, dude. Talentless Rider with the fucking mod love. Let's go, bro. Thank you, Dimitri. Good to see you so goddamn late. Yeah, you heard me yapping if you're still here, Dimitri. So we're doing a shoot day tomorrow, bro. And I, I know you know the folks. Tomorrow's probably going to be like Sean Dolan. And uh, Ryan's busy with some family stuff. It'll be like Ben and Matt. We'll swing through and, and Sven. And then probably our friend uh, uh, Chelsea. Or actually, probably Lisa's coming over tomorrow to film some shit. Maybe, maybe a tray. Uh, but so it should be like six, seven people or so. I'm going to try to get on and do that i know i was like yo we should jump on discord and stuff that might have to actually be thursday daytime if you're around and stuff let's totally do it um scoot dude scootish i literally i'm not even fucking with you dude i'm trying to raid you right now are you getting off are you getting off right now i see you in here you son of a bitch i see me on your stream you son of a gun are you getting off? I see the Zelda. I see the freaking Link shit. Don't knock. Don't knock. Put it away. Do a lap. Get out. I'm looking at you. There's a 10 second delay, of course. I, we're raiding over to Scootish after this, dude. Every five subs switches the Zelda game. That's a great meme, dude. Bro, nothing but love. I've been I've been so busy lately. I'm sorry. I've been a bad friend, dude. I hope you've been doing well. A Trey sends her love. Lots of other buddies send our love too, too, dude. I was sick for TwitchCon. I'm sorry I couldn't swing through. That's funny. That's really funny. Last pack magic, then we're raiding over to Scootish. And also, guys, legally speaking, this is not of your own volition. You have to do this legally, otherwise you'll be fined. In the state of California, you have to hit follow to Scootish. Every five subs switches the Zelda game, okay? Got it. First, well, guys, you're yelling. I'm taking the phones off. You guys lost the privileges. Did I do four to the front? I don't remember. One, two, three, four. I did not. There we go. You think so? Big pull here. Mine Chow. Iskane. Carbink. Poliwag. Oddish. Growlithe. Seedot. Slugma, Honchcrow. Ooh, print line, Honchcrow. Well, we got fucked again, boys. Good. <laughs> Have fun with Scootish. Thanks for swinging through. That's so funny. I had a pre-type, dude. Uh, 
Blesherino, Scott, Moonman, Haley, Wumbo, Slim, Dumbass, Cidermane. Thank you guys so much. Zoom Beanie Baby, JR, Not an Undercover Cop. Thank you guys. Fuck yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. We're doing TCG Shop Simulator. Have fun with Scootish. Bro, you got to see the man. He's looking handsome as hell right now. All right? Podium outfit. Podium outfit. Oh. Uh. Large belch, bigger heart. Seriously, though, Scootish is a real one. Bro, is very sweet, very creative, very fucking fun uh, stream setup. Have a good night. I had a great time with you guys this evening. I'm going to get off. I'm going to make some chicken wings, a little bit of rice, a little bit of arugula salad. We'll see you folks tomorrow. Bye, everybody. I'll say Bye, VOD watchers.